Hmm. Hi guys, hi offline gang. What's up? Hope you're hanging out. Hope you're doing good. What's up, SpongeBob? SpongeBob. My hair's not dry or beer or bee. Limfowl. Fair. I add the jovial. We're just waiting for notice to go up per usual. We'll see what happens. I see you have made a new video on the same thing last video. Taxes be killing me. You're telling me, dude, I was scrambling last minute this morning. And I and I had to make a video. I had to upload the video. Yeah, I did make a video on the same thing. That is true. Honestly, if I could, if if I in hindsight, I probably would have saved that for Monday or next Friday. Um, because I think the thumbnails are too similar to Monday's video. Um, and they're too close together. Uh, for like the same topic, and that's on me. Um, oh well, too late now. Why are you? Uh, out of spite, pretty much. <laughs> Taxes be killing me, bro. I already read that, sorry. Disgusting, don't talk to us. You're, you're not allowed to talk at me either. I didn't watch it right away since I thought it was the same video as the first. I mean, yeah, that's a, it's a shame because like, I fucked that up on my own, but learning experience. This is the problem when you upload often. You're like, I can make another video on the same thing and get views. Nope. <laughs> it, it was like funny though, because like last video was one to 10, which means it did the best out of the last 10 videos. And this one was like 10 of 10. And I was like, huh, I've never seen two back to back videos on the same topic do that before, but it happens. You roasting that person was hilarious. I mean, yeah. But I do kind of owe them half that video's content. Like, I literally, I took so much shit from the DMs they sent me. So, jokes aside, shout out to them for giving me content for it. Zero viewers, I simply don't exist. I'm sorry, man. You'll be fading out of uh, my memory shortly. OMG, quite, quite, quote, and quite with a Y, all in the same room. That is a good point. You, you had, like, I know that's a joke, but you have never seen us all in the same room before. We, like... You have no way of knowing that we're not the same person. We're not. We're all different people. But you, you like, you, you haven't seen definitive proof of all, us all standing next to each other to know that for sure, you know? Are you playing another FNAF fan game, bro? Nah, nah, nah. Tonight we're doing a horror game that I saw on TikTok and also saw Corey Kenshin play. Or I saw that he had played. I hadn't watched his video on it because I didn't want spoilers. Thanks for the sub, Cruel. Appreciate it. Quite stole Eli Art's stream idea on go Oh my god. That's fucked up, man. I didn't tell Eli I'm sorry. I didn't mean it like that. Corey? Yeah, he's like, he's a funny ass dude. And a prime person to steal ideas from. Quite, I just returned from the back rooms. Take a shower, it's smelly back there. Yeah, you, you, like, it's very musky and moldy. I know for a fact you need to bathe after going down there. New quite stream bell, yeah, nice. So I wanted to get your guys' opinion on this. I recently changed the second channel profile picture, and it looks sick. It was drawn by Ariwa. They're my thumbnail artist and very talented, very skilled at what they do. Changed the alt Twitter to that as well. And I'm wondering if because my Twitch is more associated with my second channel than with my main, if I should change the profile picture here to that as well. But, but like technically this is my main Twitch account. Like I only have the one Twitch. So I'm wondering if for brand consistency, it should be anything with the name quite should have the same thing or if I should put it in line with the content. Make a second Twitch account, duh, funny. Yes, ye. I kind of, yeah, I, I, I was kind of, I genuinely do not care. If you didn't care, why, why did, why were you, why did you be so mean about it? I mean, sure, my feeling by saying that. 
I vote yes, PFP is sick. Yeah, it, part of it is also it looks really fucking cool, and I want to put it as many places as possible. <laughs> Thanks for the sub, Vicious Bot. Appreciate it. Do a poll? Maybe later. I just wanted to get a, a survey, or like a general survey as opposed to an official one. How much coom can you consume without dying? I've always thought about this. If you like eat your own cum, do you, would you gain weight? Cause like that's technically stuff that came from your body. Like it's weight you lost by shooting it. And, the, and then when you absorb the nutrients from it, does it, do, do you, would you still lose weight? Like cumulatively? Unless you're shooting blanks, I guess. I guess at some point you'd shoot blanks. Huh? What, bro? Why are you guys being, why are you guys making it weird? Why are, you, why are you guys making this weird? Do you think this often? I think about things like this often, but not this specific thing. You thought about this? Just now, yes, which is why I'm bringing it up. Only one way to find out. Yeah, cum exclusive diet. Only eating cum for a month straight. I'm, I'm going to make a super size style documentary where like the only thing I eat is my own cum. <laughs> oh, God. Thanks for the sub, Artie Wardy. Appreciate it. I mean, it's full of protein. Yeah, but that protein has to come from stuff you've already eaten. Or, like, protein you've already consumed. So I imagine you'd lose weight over time and then lose the ability to produce cum as you only eat cum. Like, you're diminishing returns, you know? Like, there's levels of energy. You know how, like, um, primary, like, carnivores get the most efficient energy usage because they eat directly from plants? And then, like, secondary predators and primary predators, like, energy is lost as the food chain goes? I imagine like an accelerated version of that exe like exists if you solely eat the sticky stuff your body produces, you know? If you start eating cum, will you eventually start pooping it too? I don't think you'd think about it. If it was like thick water, right? Do you get full off thick water? Thick water? Like, what do you mean thick? Like viscous? Wait, you should make a th your shower thoughts into a podcast. I mean, that's pretty close to what stream is. You guys just can immediately shout at me for saying the bullshit that I do, you know? That's literal cannibalism in, an or, in a, another form. It's called auto cannibalism, which is like, you know how an autobiography is a biography written by yourself? Like auto cannibalism, it's eating your own human body. I love that this is a genuine conversation. It, it's, it, it's fun, all right? It's a, not fun. It's a very thought-provoking matter. <laughs> Quite, you should make a video about the odd things you think about. See, I, I really can only talk about this on a regular basis on Twitch. If I opened up a video with this lengthy of a conversation about something, like, that, like, do you think that would go well for monetization rights? Quite, you are honestly my uncomfort streamer and I'm living for it. Thanks for the sub, Alexander the Great and Mango. And that's exactly how I'm designing it. I'm trying to make it, I'm trying to get a viewer base pull of people who already hate me. So if some bad shit comes up, they're like, well, I already hated the guy, so whatever. It's like, I already knew he was a piece of shit. I wasn't watching him because he was a good person. <laughs> uh, what's my favorite G Fuel flavor? I really like the Sonic Peach Rings one. I feel like I go on about that all the damn time. You would eventually start producing it again? Maybe. Actually, you know, this would be a funny topic. Or like stupid shit like this would be a funny thing to do on the third channel. I used to call the music channel the third channel, but I think it just kind of exists out of my usual sphere because i don't really upload youtube type content to it it's literally just for music and that has no kind of schedule quite planning on getting canceled certainly not planning for it definitely preparing for it you know who knows i've only tried the sonic peach ring flavor taste good yeah right What are my pronouns? I think we have a command for that, right? Uh, yeah, funny, funny, here we go. Cancellation isn't a scheduled event. It would be nice if you could know exactly when Twitter's gonna, like, have a trending tag about you, so you could, like, pre-write your response, and instead of stressing over it, you just have it, like, scheduled tweet. Do y'all for real not know about thick water? Jacqueline, I'm, I'm being honest, I have no idea what this is. Thick water. Thick water is a beverage designed for people with dysphagia, difficulty swallowing. You can purchase pre-thickened water or you can thicken drinking water at home with over-the-counter thickening agents. 
It, it, like, I really thought this was going to be a sex thing. Pleasantly surprised. So water, but viscous. I'm pretty sure. I, I, I want to double check that I've been using the word viscous, right? Having a thick, sti yeah, 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 thick, thick, sticky consistency. It tastes like thick, weak vinegar. <laughs> gravy water, gravy water. <laughs> Holy fuck, that is vile. Somehow that's worse than the cum conversation. Just gravy water. They make guests drink it. Oh shit, you're right. That wait, no, you're you're totally right. I remember, I haven't watched an, a full episode of Chuckle Sandwich in a while, and they did that bit at the end of the Freddie Wong one, and that surprised like that. That's where I've heard it before, actually. They make them drink thick water. It's like gooey water. Thank you for the five hundred bits, Kaylee the Cat. Appreciate it. Uh, Ryder Soul says 1W1. I think you're referring to World War One. There's two W's, not two ones. Just a correction for the future. Don't fuck it up again. Otherwise, you'll get a B in your report card. Rip Connor on the most recent. I didn't watch. I don't really watch Chuckle Sandwich that often. Like, I see the clips a lot. And I see it on my, um, uh, I see it on my TikTok page and I laugh. But I'm like, no sub sounds. Oh, shit. Fuck. I think the, the speakers was on the wrong setting. That's my bad. For some reason, my computer will, like, reset the desktop audio as the default. And the default is usually my headphones. But sometimes I have to manually go in to set it as my headphones, but it just feels like being finicky. It's annoying. But like I was saying, like, I like Chuckle Sandwich. It's just I lock in to listening to one podcast at a time because I don't listen to podcasts often. Like, I don't get through a full episode in a day. Um, what I, and right now I'm listening to a lot of Trash Taste. Like, that's just kind of my, that's kind of like my background noise podcast. The music of my nightmares. At least it, at least you didn't have to start at the beginning of the thing this time. Do you keep up with Soft William Co.? You knew who Big T was. You listened to their music? I've heard some of it. I think it fucking bangs. I've, I've, uh, I was on their Minecraft server a while ago, but every single one of those dudes is chill as hell. I got love for all of them. They started a podcast recently, didn't they? The group chat podcast? I, like, just being in calls with them, that is like the... I was surprised they hadn't done it before then. Because they have, like, the most, one of the most natural dynamics I've gotten to sit on. Like, they, they, those dudes are great. And am I gonna play that daddy dating simulator? We've already played Dream Daddy. Like, we did a full playthrough on the uh, main channel, or the second channel. I typically don't revisit those things very soon after, unless it's like a sequel deal. The boys should let you on Trash Taste. I mean, I don't know, man. I don't think I'm of, this, I'm of the clout level. And also, you need to be physically in Japan, which is just like not an option for anybody right now. <laughs> you quite be pretty good musician. Thank you. Appreciate that. All right. I think we've stalled for long enough. Um, it's been a minute since we've done this. Flinders video starts now. It's been a minute since we've done this, but um, we're playing some horror game I found today. Uh, it's called The Closing Shift, and every single one-off scary game we play takes place during someone's fucking night shift. Just having to raw dog the endless void of the moon being outside on their own. It's kind of AIDS. Um, but anyways, I, I, you know what? Let me just let me just get this booted open, and um, I feel like the longer I stall, the more I'm gonna work myself up to be scared of it. Closing the closing shift. Okay, pausing the Pokemon music, the true horror of the stream. Oh shit! Damn, th this is like a very straightforward thing. There's no intro. It does not waste your fucking time. It's just right here. Alright, let me uh, move everything so it's where it needs to be, instead of in the React placements. Uh, there we go. I think that's good. Okay, the closing shift. New game. The closing shit! I wish there was a closing shit. Like, it'd be a lot more convenient if, like, it would stop pooing at some point. Okay, WASD is movement, interact is left click, tab is inventory, shift is run, see, okay, pretty standard. Oh no, I'll be late for work. I was pooing too long. I should be on my car by now. 
he like he, this guy goes to work by riding on the roof as someone it, like his roommate drives him. He lost a bet and he's stuck doing that forever. I gotta turn this down a little bit. Um, is there a? I'm just gonna assume that this is as big as the FOV goes. Horror games tend to like not give you a lot of room to see shit. Which makes sense, but it's very... It can be headache-inducing for the first couple minutes. Damn, my shoes be looking 2D as hell. Guys, I'm literally... It, I think this, is, this game was made by a Japanese studio, by the way. Leave apartment. Wait. I have to wait first. Okay, I can do that. Do I need to drink, sip my coffee? My two-dimensional coffee texture? Good to know that reflections are not something that I have. Don't waste my time on that. Dude, sprinting while, like, I'm using 40 FOV is fucking... Brain clog. Oh, it's a... Um... Why don't you just juju on the beat? I'm trying to... How do I... How do I go forward? Oh, oh. I see. It was a menu. That makes sense. Wow, this view is so nice. This apartment must cost $7,000 a month. They've modeled a rather nice cityscape, I'd say. Like, even though it's pretty limited sight, I feel like they've gotten the density of it pretty convincingly. Can I just walk into other people's houses? I was hoping this could turn into a breaking and entering simulator, considering how many extra hallways they've created for me. I like the filters. Yeah, they add that aesthetic, but they don't take away any kind of visual clarity. Like, I can still tell where every... Oh, it's just somebody playing something on the radio. I can sample that. Should I uh, up the audio at all? Keep me posted on how the audio is as we get into, like, more sound-dense environments in the game. Because it's just... Someone's phone. Well, my phone now. It ain't someone's. It belongs to me. Where the hell is my car? I'm a steal. Uh, the only car in existence is mine. Is Twitch lagging for you guys? If it is... Someone's phone. Thank you for the sub, Akashi. Appreciate it. Yo, free alkaline battery, yummy. Finders keepers, more like Flinders keepers. Flinders, I own you. JK, just a funny gag, guys. Oh wait, right, it's the other side. What, uh, or not? How do I drive a car? I think I'm gonna turn up the brightness slightly because it is I, it is, like, a little tough to see. Let me put it up to, like, 25. Hope that works. Holy fuck, that reflection got so much worse. How do I open this? How do I- how do I press the correct button? This is- this is the problem with, uh, streaming. Is this my car? I don't know, it, it, it's got- like, this is the objective marker. How do I get in? I really don't know. You have to buy it first? From from who? Break the window with the phone? Can I throw it? Sit on the hood. They used to ride these for miles. Oh, I have to return the phone. I gotta find who it, who it belongs to then. Because I have no damn clue. You didn't grab the keys, maybe? Maybe I should go check for them, yeah. I just have to remember which apartment I live in. Look around, go behind car. Find the old man. Okay, I guess I'll, I'll try returning the phone then. Let me go find an elderly individual. Man, those trees are apparently made out of concrete. No need to go here right now. Okay, bud. Nothing behind the car. 
Oh, look, there's the old guy. I could barely fucking see him. Excuse me. Excuse me. That guy is tripping balls right now. He is on so many tabs of acid. Hey, uh, are you looking for something? Well, I found this. Gimme it. Gimme me it. Okay. How did I not see him the entire time? This is my car. <laughs> Guys, this is my car. <laughs> Okay, I'll be- I'll be driving now. <laughs> Dude, the labels are so literal. My car. It's my car. Like, I just imagine this is someone's internal monologue in, like, being translated into game UI. Hmm. Like, hmm. My car. <laughs> Alright, gonna sabotage the electrical grid, just completely tank the power in my building so I can skip my shit. Ooh. I cannot read any of this. <coughs> Open. Okay, closing shift moment. Toilet room. The around here. Wait. Where the fuck do I get back to? There it is. Put away my stuff and talk to Senpai. Zero of two. Oh, we're, we're in mid-COVID. This is COVID game. COVID canonical. Hot drink tutorial mixtape. My locker. Okay, done. Sorry, I'm late. Unahashi senpai. Be careful. Next time I'm going to tell the manager. I am very sorry. I'll be careful. Being careful is not enough. Tell me you won't be late. Do you understand? God, he's so commanding. Yes, sir. I will not be late again. You also... <laughs> Senpai, it's like Friday Night Fucking! They took it from Friday Night Fucking! Christ, dude. You also mess up some orders, don't you? If you have any trouble with the order, there are some tutorial videos for you, so look through it. Okay, I'll take a look. Oh, and one more thing. Make sure to leave your phone in the locker. You better not be texting anyone during work. Yes, sir. Wage slave simulator. Is there a way to make the uh, subtitles just kind of appear on screen instead of doing the typewriter shit? Because that takes a while. Guess not. Okay. Hot. Cold. What? Did he just dip on me? Oh, okay, bye, prick. He just stops there. He like, oh, that car's wheels are not moving. Oh, there's somebody outside. God damn it! I gotta do my goddamn job. Takahashi said, "Did you say Chula's Coffee? I've never been to one of those fancy places before. I feel uneasy. There's something strange about this place. My daughter seems to be a fan of this place, and now I'm here. However." Er, uh, I'll leave the drinks to you. Oh, and I'd like to get two of them. Would you want a latte and a coffee? Oh, that'll be just fine. It's really uncomfortable here. I wonder if he's uncomfortable. However, can you- how can you charge such a price for something like this? I mean, you're the one who walked in the damn store, bud. How do I make a coffee and a latte? Drip coffee is a coffee. God, this is more stressful than an actual job. Order sticker. Where do I put the sticker? Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh shit, god damn it. Trash item? Where do I stick the sticker? Look closely. Oh, that's gonna be important later. Five Nights at Freddy Simulator. Nine to five gaming. I need the hot... Hot cup. Coffee dispenser. Epic. Coffee plus steamed milk. Coal hot lid. Where 
where's the milk dispenser? I'm very fast at this. I'm, ve I'm a very efficient coffee maker, you know that? Milk pitchers. Place cup. Watching quite struggle is somewhat satisfying. Does it make you feel good about yourself? Watching me do fucking dog shit at this? Is this fun to you? How do I trash this? Where's the coffee beans? Who needs them? Not me. How long does it take to fucking fill up a milk pitcher, dog? What the hell? He's not doing good, but he has the spirit. Thank God there is not a time limit on this shit. I am fucking this up so hard. There's no milk in it. He needs a coffee and a latte, doesn't he? It's like both of them, ain't he? Okay, you know what? I'm trying again. I'm trying again. I'm smart. I can do this, guys. I can do this. Please stop bullying me. I'm very sensitive. You have to grab milk from the fridge and put it in the steamer? <laughs> I hate working an actual job. Dude, if I did not have YouTube as my profession, I would be fucked. You had a bad day? Is this the fridge? Get ice? This is not correct. No milk in the picture, boss. I see that, which is why I put it in the funny drip thing. But it has not filled up. You need milk in the milk pitcher? Gee, I wonder why I hadn't thought of that. As opposed to boneful beans? Where the hell is the fridge? Fine, I'll watch the tapes, goddammit. Thanks for the sub, Mick Elameo. Oh, it's literally just game. The fridge is on the bottom. I see. I can do this. I can do. This is so easy, guys. Whipped cream. Soy milk. This did not work as planned. Put your bone marrow in there. Good idea. It has to be normal milk. Oh, there's two types of There's two types of- I fucking hate this game. I hate this game so much. Why is this the hard part? Why is this the hard part? There's normal milk? Apparently. That shit seems made up. I, I, I guess I didn't do it. Normal steamed milk? I fucking hate this game. I fucking hate this game. This was a mistake. This was a mistake. Don't worry, you can do this 50 more times. I'm so screwed. When does the scary happen? Probably when I stop being a bumbling idiot. <laughs> Quite could not make it working a 9 to 5? Absolutely not, dude. I would be so screwed if this was not my job. Wait, please, I'm in agony. Please stop being so bad. I don't make coffee, guys. I make fucking G Fuel in the morning. <laughs> He's, you know, he is fucking, has the, patient of a, the patience of a saint, dog. He is so considerate. I don't know how to do this. Did I put the milk- how do I fucking steam the milk? You're doing it right, but you need to put the sticker on the cup? Oh. 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 Yeah, I would be why did no one train me for this job? This is not my fault.
Okay, I just can't even do it. This is the first order, by the way. This is McDonald's level customer service. Dude, if you know McDonald's, you know it's better than this. Yeah, there's stickers. I'm trying to put the cup down so I can place that shit. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna do this right this time. Or how the fuck do I put the sticker on it? Place the pitcher, put the milk in, and steam it, please, dear God. Okay, the pitcher is in. Milk. Okay. Okay. Victory. Victory. Holy shit, guys, I'm doing it. I'm actually doing it. Now, how the fuck do I put the sticker on it? How do I put the sticker on it? How do I put the sticker on it? Holy crap, any percent? I can't put down the cup to put the sticker on it! I can't place the cup to put the fucking sticker on it! But the cap- THE CAP IS ON RIGHT NOW! Oh, it's literally just the fucking- I thought I had the- You see, I thought I had the- You see, I thought I had the cup in my hand. This is really embarrassing. This is really embarrassing for me. All right, you know what? I'm gonna empty my inventory and try from from scratch. Like you, I, like I'm tossing everything. And we're starting again, but I can do it. I'll do it right this time. Okay. Quite really unsmart. We're babying him at this point. You guys are really fucking mean to me. You guys are really fucking mean to me. You are infantilizing me. Oh, he just gave the fuck up. I had it. I finally got the order. Why is it not in my inventory? Well. We're not infantilizing you, you just suck. You- you physically said you're babying me. Well, only three more hours of this to go, guys. It only took 20 minutes. Hello, ma'am. Did you hear on the news? I hear stalker cases are on the rise. It's scary. A woman like me, you see, I have to be careful. All the guys are always staring at me, so... You be careful, too. Well, you don't have to worry as much as I do, but you should what? <laughs> she just called me an ugly broad. But you should watch out either way. A dark mocha chip chilla poop chilla put pussy pussy no? Holy fuck. Okay. Dark chocolate chip chilla puccino. Blended ice. Coffee, milk. I could do this. Okay, blended ice. Cold cup. Let's put let's put that down first. No, what? Whoops. Ice. Put the uh, wet. Get it going. Nice. Let me uh, let me uh. Blended ice plus coffee plus milk. Blended ice plus coffee. Plus milk. I'm assuming it's normal milk because it's cold, right? Uh chocolate syrup. Chocolate sauce. Chocolate sauce and cocoa powder. And 
then a funny lid. Wait, I gotta I gotta put the funny sticker on it. I did not do this correctly. Oh, I think I got the wrong lid. There we go. Ma'am, it's ready to serve. Take take that shit. I swear to God. Ma'am, if you don't take the goddamn order, you need a cold cup lid? It's the cold cup lid is on. You have to put the sticker on the cup? What what do you think I just tried to do? What do you think I just tried to do when I pulled out the sticker, clicked on it, and it did that shit? What do you think I just tried to do? I'm clicking on it with the sticker. And I can't put it down here to apply to it. Wrong order. Okay, fuck it, try it again. Okay. Blended ice, coffee. Wait, wait, wait. It was a chocolate chip one, right? Okay. Back to the drawing board, boys. She's gonna leave too. Calm down? No, I will not. This is like one of the most stressful games I've ever played, man. This like genuinely simulates being a, you know, a service worker, in my opinion, because I'm stressed to my mind. This would be less stressful if I wasn't doing it in front of anybody. Coffee, milk. Chocolate sauce. Cocoa powder. Lid. There you go, ma'am. Get the fuck out of my house. How do you still have a job? Uh, cause I'm my own boss. Only I can fire me, technically speaking. Damn, what did- what the hell is going on outside? What the fuck? Ma'am? Was that white van there before? Oh, that's a uh, quite a few fellas. Why are they sidewalking in just shuffling? Matcha cake, please. Stop pushing me. A salted caramel mocha. Then I'll have a matcha chilla pacino. You always can't finish your drink, so let's share, man. Sure, let's do that. One pumpkin cake. I think I'll have something to eat, too. You can order first. I'll have, um, hot cocoa. Hot cocoa, are you serious? I don't have any money right now. Oh, the door just closed on its own. You should have said that first. Come on, I'll buy you one. What do you want to drink? Yes, but... Just say it, he's got money. No, it's not like that, but really, anything is fine. Really, I want a white mocha. Okay, any food? No, uh, just the drink. Oh, come on, let's order some food. Uh, American waffles? Do we have those? Waffles. Uh, thanks, both of you. Hey, where are you looking at? Did you hear that noise? No- I don't even know what the fuck to order. <laughs> noise? What noise? I didn't hear it either. Uh, it's probably nothing. It must be your imagination. It happens from time to time. Ha 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 ha, you stupid fuck, you stupid idiot fuck. You're the person in the friend group we make fun of. Sis, I've made up my mind. An apple pie. Will that be all? Yes, that's all. Um... Um... Uh, what? Middle one? Wow. Can't believe you remembered all that. We'll be waiting. Ah. <sighs> you will be waiting indeed. See, the game memorized all that shit, but I did not. 
Oh no. Oh no. I completely forgot the order. Oh, thank God, it says the names of them. Okay, Matcha Chilipuccino first. Blended ice. Okay, guys, get ready to be here for the next 40 hours. Get all the pastries first. Blended ice, milk. I'm gonna just do this since I already started it. Okay. Blended ice, milk. No! I fucking misclicked! I wanna kill myself! Oh! I've gotta trash it. I gotta start over. Imagine him doing a spear into this. I think I would actually die. Like, I would literally cease to exist. American apple pie. Where do I get the apple pies from? Are they in the back or some shit? Where are the, where's the apple pie kept? White would implode into the void? I'm planning on doing that. Oh, pastry shelf. I will put- the, I'm just gonna slap it on his face with no fucking- This is the, uh, um... What the fuck? Why did it not place the funny meme on it? Okay, waffle time. Uh, what was it? Pastries first, right? Pumpkin cake. I'll just be grabbing this with my bare fingies. I'm gonna give these guys so many diseases on purpose for giving me this much grief. American waffle. Where the fuck are the waffles? Sweet red beans and butter bread. Is there a waffle maker somewhere? If you think really hard, the, the food might appear in front of you. We are going to have so many viewers by the end of the stream, I don't see anybody leaving out of boredom. That's definitely not something you guys would do. You are, you are always entertained by me at all times. Waffles are on the pastry shelf. Did I miss them? Matcha chiffon, pumpkin. What am I, what am I not seeing? Strawberry, sweet red butter buns, baked cheese tart. Oh, okay, both doors slide all the way, got it. There we go. fun but okay uh time for the drinks white mocha i think that's one of the shorter ones ain't it white mocha coffee steamed milled white chocolate sauce coffee steamed milk plus chocolate yeah, yeah okay coffee uh milk milk Milk. You should be paid extra because this shit is confusing. Okay, cool. Thanks for the sub, Jake. Doing my taxes, or am I? I did mine this morning. It fucking sucked. Hot cup lid. What the fuck? Oh, did I do it in the wrong order? Oh, I forgot to put the fucking steam milk in it. I am a moron. Thanks for the hundred bits. Nat. 
now the white chocolate sauce. The hot cup lid. White mocha. What? What did I do wrong this time? Wait, did it not? Why is it not putting the steamed milk in? What did I do wrong? I'm, I'm being defeated by life right now. I'm going to be honest with you. Like, I am honestly just in pain. He sucks at this, bro. You just noticed? Congrats, bro. You got fucking eyes. No shit. Fucking fuck, jeez. Good god. Like, I'm do- I did the steps in the right order, but you can only put the milk on certain platforms. Hmm. I have a job at a coffee shop. It's pure hell. Tumblr lied to me. Working at a coffee shop sucks. You will never find love because the workers there will just, like, never be having a good time. Oh, wait, there's- I completely forgot this pastry. Matcha chip, chip There it is. Bam. Oh, did I not put the label on? There you go. Have fun, bud. Salted caramel mocha. Uh, salted caramel mocha. Coffee. I cannot fuck this up. It'll take too damn long, man. I gotta do this right the first time. Steamed milk. Okay, okay, okay. What's next? Steamed milk plus caramel syrup. Caramel syrup. Hazelnut syrup. Plus chocolate sauce. Okay. First time, baby! First time! Fucking... I crushed that one. I, yo, thank you for the five subs, Dacrophobia. Guys, I'm- I'm getting- you know, I, I'm getting- I'm getting the hang of this. I'm getting the hang of this, I think. Chilipuccino. Matcha chilipuccino is blended ice plus milk. Blended ice plus milk. Thanks for the sub, Kevin Magic. Appreciate it. Blended ice. Plus milk. Plus matcha powder, whipped cream. Matcha powder and... Cold lid. And, uh... Okay, holy shit. Nerve-wracking. I wouldn't- I never want to work a service job again. This isn't even scary and I still shit myself. How are we already an hour in? Oh my god, I am so bad at making coffee, man. God bless the NPCs in this game. Oh! That doesn't seem right. That was very odd. He... These people are just progressively ignoring the laws of physics more and more. Here's my order. Order... Latte. Okay. Okay. I can do that. Coffee plus steamed milk. Okay. No problem, bud. I got you. Coffee plus... Steamed milk. Wow, 
Why the fuck didn't it put the steamed milk in? Fucking crap. It always does this with steamed milk specifically. This is so frustrating. Okay. Try making more steamed milk. What even is steamed milk? It's heated up milk. Hey, I'm a private investigator. You spot anything suspicious around this area? There have been numerous reports of people getting harassed. I was wondering if you've seen anything in the store. Uh, ellipses. Call me if something ever happens. Try closing the store early if you don't want to get in trouble. Huh, that wasn't scary at all. Wow, there are lids right here. I could have been saving so much time. Sweep the floor. Zero of five. And he's gone. Where the goddamn broom at? That was the same dude from earlier, was it? Yeah, I think I'm gonna go home, actually. Or not. Where is the broom at? Brown closet. The bathroom. There's a brown closet. Toilet. This is a nice bathroom. By the lockers? Okay. The back door is open? Oh yeah, the entire time. There we go. Room. Look at that. Good as new. How? Who took a fat dump on the floor? Whose diarrhea stains are these? Seriously. How does it get this bad in such specific spots? Being all the way in the back of this corner seems dangerous. You know, just from a horror game logic perspective. And someone shit right by the entrance and we didn't do anything about it? That's not good. I think I'm going to hide in the back room. Milk? Don't cry over spilt milk now. Well, that's everything. What? 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 Why, um... Why so much spilt milk? Um... Put it back in the fridge. It was on the floor. We're going to use that shit again? Thanks for the sub, Pro Deadshot. It begins? Oh, no. Just napping on the job. What? Huh. I'm back home, I guess. Thanks for the sub, Zombie Barry. I'm going to turn the sound up a little bit now that we're in the scary bits. I want you guys to shit yourselves. So bad. I want you to poo yourself so loud and fart and, re and brown and... Windy out tonight. Windy day out, isn't it? Windy out tonight. Windy day out tonight, isn't it? Some windy weather we're having. Is there a man standing in front of my car suspiciously again? This is my car. You keep trying to skip forward? Wow. You don't want to experience this in real time with the rest of us? Hater. Fake fan. Wimdy. 
Put away my stuff and talk to Senpai. Zero of two. Oh shit. Here we go again. Who's this guy? Who's this guy? Hey, seriously? You're late again. Did you oversleep? I'm so sorry. No, not I'm so sorry. I want you to not be late. This is the second time. I'm sorry. A little more enthusiasm would help, don't you think? Why don't you ask your mama to wake you up? She's dead. Bro's floating. Did you? He moonwalked that shit, dude. No, thank you. I'm a triple protect, I think. Hey, what's up, guy? Your face is fucked up, dude. Here's my order. Coffee. How do I make coffee? I have no idea. Coffee. Is this a Costa Horror game? I'm not sure exactly who made it. I believe it was a Japanese dude. I don't know. Here you go, sir. Are you smoking indoors? Um... I, I gave it to him. He took it. Who? Who? Yeah, I'm not going crazy, am I? There's more? What did I miss? Drip coffee. Coffee. I don't have the order tag any... Unless I just fucked it up. American scone caramel toffee. Oh, okay, he's got a few order stickers. I'm stupid. American waffle. Uh, American apple pie. White as a coffee making god. Yeah, one click and I did one click, Jim. Here you go. Uh, scone caramel toffee. That's there's a whole ass man. Yeah, he's not bothering anyone. This is a public access area, technically speaking. I can't get him taken off the premises yet. Ah, hey girl, thank you very much. Hmm. Haha, <laughs> you look impressed. No need to... I don't know what that means. I've been living here for more than 15 years. Hey girl, something's not right about this place. I didn't think that because I'm not around town. Something about this store. Dot dot dot. Maybe because of that guy over there. Shit. Huh? I guess it was just my imagination. Are you haunted by any chance? Well, maybe I am. Haha. <laughs> Either way, I'm running late, so I'm gonna have to go. So long. I don't- I don't think he was being racist, Momo Young. I think this game takes place in Japan. Uh, real f- Uh, real fast, guys. I'm gonna run an ad break. Um, because we're hitting the hour mark. It, I, we're going to be playing this game for longer than I thought, so I want to pee so we can be in it for the long haul. Give me one minute and we'll be right back to it.
Wash your margarine up. Get a pussy and I'm gonna beat it up. Get a pussy and I'm gonna beat it up. My name is Playboy Cardi and it's up. You've never pooed in your bed ever? I've never pooed ever. Not once. Never needed to. Just, I'm 100% nutrient efficient. I keep all of that shit in and burn it. I use 100% of everything I consume. Dead back. You're damn right I am. Ah. IPAs taste like shit. Or this one does at least. The one I had like last week was pretty good. Am I done planning or am I just starting? Just starting. Well, not just starting. We've been here for an hour, but I was just taking an ad break. All right, back to it. Is the audio balance? You better not walk in that door, bud. You better have disappeared behind the wall. He's coming into the store. Hello, guy who looks weirdly like me. Oh, he's already made his order. This is awesome. Milk? J I guess the dude just wants milk? Or is it, is do I add an extra milk to the vanilla chili pacino? Okay, blended ice. Why is he looking at me like that? Blended ice plus milk. Plus vanilla syrup plus vanilla powder. Make sure the 200 bits arson is fairy. Wait, it was, uh, I forgot the order. Vanilla, vanilla syrup then vanilla powder, okay. Vanilla syrup. Vanilla powder. Don't add extra milk. Okay. Okay, I didn't fuck it up. There you go, bud. And then just milk, right? He just wanted some milk? Milky? Milky? I assume cold cup, right? Because you only you put the steamed milk in the hot cups, right? Make sure the sub spicy moose. Appreciate it. Was he filming it? Uh, he might have been. Okay, and one more. Wait, nope. Done. His hands. What I, I I hate the fast forwarding shit, man. It freaks me out every time. Oh, so these dudes are looking more and more like they're from Second Life. This guy's skin costs like thousands of dollars in Roblox. Thanks for the Prime sub, Rage Bear Gaming. Appreciate it. You're cute. Can I have your number? Um, would you like to order anything? Hmm. Your heart. I think I'll go with your recommendation. What's your name? Tell me your name. Our recommendation would be the limited time only double chocolate chili puccino. I see. What's your phone number? I'm that good looking, aren't I? I'd lose words myself. I'm quite popular around here. I just don't think you are, dog. Your shoulders are two completely different heights. Now is your chance. How do you verbalize a star? Just contact me, okay? What's with the attitude? You'll regret this. I'm going home. Don't ever look at me like that again, dog. That ain't right. That ain't right. That ain't right. Bro was an actual mannequin. And he's he's got he's literally has a big white van. What was I what was gonna happen if I went in there? Take out trash and bus tables. Well, how did this get here? Who opened the door? I know I closed that shit. 
I thought I was gonna almost did this one at a time. That would have been so AIDS. Bus tables. Cleaning equipment, right? Cleaning rag. Dude's acting like we a soulmate or some shit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, this cleaning rag is gonna vaporize these cups of empty coffee. Photo? Oh! Oh, Ooh, he was filming that shit for sure. Whose car is that? Who's got- who- they're leaving the engine running, so that's... more concerning. I definitely did not do all seven. That was- I did three. November 27th. Or 11 27? Okay. Hmm. Water. Not a fan. What the fuck is this game? It's called the closing shift. It's the shift you work in. Um, apparently it gets nuts as you go on. At least it's a nice house. I mean, it's definitely small, but it's kind of efficient. Like, a, the the person I'm playing as definitely has a good taste in interior design. <gasps> oh! Oh! Mm. Holy fuck. Oh my god. Watch where you're going. Jesus, young ones these days. Holy Christ. I was mid-commentary, dude. That's fucked up. It, like, like I, I feel like my... Like, I would still get scared if I was playing this on my own, but my reactions are dialed up because I'm in performance mode. So when I get knocked out of it, I'm like fucking so, caught so off guard. Bro, I almost died, Jesus. Why is the perspective of my own car, the cutscene, from a hand cam? God. Let me guess, I'm late again. So now that we've had a jump scare, how has the sound balancing? Is it alright where it's at? The stalker POV, real. I'm gonna be late a third time, aren't I? Today is your first closing shift. I have a question. Do you get strange customers around at night? Well, sometimes we do. Just brush it off if they come, focus on your work, there's plenty to do. Actually, I'm afraid I might be being stalked. Haha, <laughs> you want me to believe someone is interested in the likes of you? Why is everybody in this game just, like, going for the throat? I've been called an ugly fuck indirectly and directly by multiple people, dude. I guess I'll come flying to help you if anything ever happens, haha. <laughs> Clearly you can fly, so... He's racist to women. Jesus Christ, man. Hi. Hello. Wide, ma'am. Sorry, I'm going to the bathroom. Can you order a macchiato for me? Okay. Let me all have a cinnamon roll, churros, and a cup of coffee, please, and add whipped cream to it. You're gonna eat that much? No wonder you got so fat. Jeez! Huh? Paying separately? Together is fine, and I'll have a matcha chilapuccino. What? A chilapuccino? You can't be serious. Do you know how cold it is right now? I'll be fine. Oh, and what did Mari want again? And she want a macchiato? You mean Chilipuccino. She's gonna catch a cold. No, she won't. You know, I would be fine, but Mari won't be. You didn't hear what I said earlier, right? Hear what? A caramel macchiato hot, please? A hot caramel macchiato, got it? Okay. Pastries first, because that's fucking easier. Oh, I still have the photo. Awesome. Strawberry and cream roll. 
Uh, strawberry churro. Wait, whoops. You're gonna eat something from your food stash? Is all this ordering make you, making you hungry? Alright, I gotta trash all this fucking extra pastries I accidentally picked up. Okay, cool. Uh, coffee plus whipped cream. That's easy. You should be a barista? I don't think I should. I think I've proven on multiple occasions today that I fucking suck at this. You got some goldfish? Nice. Matcha chili pacino. Blended ice plus milk. Okay, I'll do that first. Like, left and came back, you were still just working as a barista? That's the whole game, man. Working the shift is the game. Yo, thank you for the five gift subs, Dacrophobia. Shit. God damn. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. Milk. Uh... I was making the matcha one, right? Yes. Okay, blended ice, milk, matcha powder, whipped cream. Matcha... Matcha powder? Matcha powder plus... The cream. Uh... No. Cold. Here you go. Okay, and now the caramel. Caramel, blended ice, coffee, milk syrup. Wait, no, no, I did- fuck, I did it wrong. Did- did it just blend the ice on its own? Blender cup plus ice. Okay, I'm trashing this. It's a cold drink, they wanted a hot drink. Yeah, they their friends fucking gypped them. Is basically is my understanding of the situation. Oh shit, I'm making a fucking I'm stupid, I'm stupid, I'm stupid. You're right, you're right. I'm an idiot. I'm so fucking dumb. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so I'm so fucking stupid. I went Uh caramel maki. Okay, okay. I'll do it right this time. It was coffee first, right? Coffee. Yo, shit, are we getting raided? Or is it just, uh, is it just Joko emote spam? I believe in you, thanks. You and only you. Uh, caramel syrup, caramel sauce. Cool. Alright, thanks. I'll pay you back now. Okay, thanks. It, what, what are you doing suspiciously by the viables in this game? Care to explain yourself, sir? I don't think, he, I don't think he's going to. I don't think he's going to. <laughs> You listened to DiCaprio 2 finally, and your favorites were probably 151 Rum and Tide. Both great picks. Who knows, he might have done something to harm us. This guy's coat is fucking sick. I want that. It, it, it looks like the cyberpunk thing. That's nuts. L latte, please. A latte. That will be 370 yen. 370 yen. Let's see. 4, 5, 6, and 100 yen. 
One, two, huh? Two 100 yens for 270 yen. Can't afford it. Oh, well, I guess better luck next time. I'll pay the rest. Oh, is that the guy from yesterday? But be a good Samaritan. That's what my father always told me. It's cold today, so drink something warm, yeah? For someone like me, don't mention it. Oh, thank the Lord. Oh, by the way, have you seen any ghosts lately? Just casually. Oh, is the background conversation about these two getting stalked? Hmm, well, technically he didn't do anything. No? And besides, I don't want to get involved in anything creepy. I see. You'll be fine, then. Yeah, you're right. How long do I have to stare at him? What was that about? Uh, maybe he's just- Oh! Synchronized standing up. I don't know. Must be the stress of poverty. Poor guy. Haha, <laughs> get it? I'm sorry. I'll have a vanilla latte. Bro, bro, like, just made a corny ass joke and felt bad immediately. Alright, vanilla latte and a latte. Latte was, um... Coffee plus steamed milk. Here is the only semi-valid customer. He apologized. Yeah, he gets a free shot at the poor dude because he's paying for his drink. Oh, wait. Fucking, I put on the wrong sticker. There we go. Nice, dude. You still have the photo? I don't know if I'm supposed to trash it or not. Vanilla syrup. Vanilla syrup. Damn, we are running out of hot cup lids on that one row specifically. Here you go, bud. Is this all the game is? It's like shit gets progressively weirder as the nights go on. You, like, actually are work- Why did a geyser just come out of nowhere? It- Basically, you keep working the job and shit gets weirder as things go along. Like, a dude was stalking us last night. Um, he, they, they were taught the girls were talking about some crazy ass story in the back before that. Uh, a private investor ca private investigator came in to tell us that some weird shit's been going on around town. Where did I find this game? Uh, it showed up on my TikTok for you page, and I thought it was interesting, and I remembered I had seen Corey Kenshin play it. Or, like, I had seen, like, he'd made a video on it. I hadn't seen him actually play it yet, because I was trying not to get it spoiled. Please don't tell me the power's about to go out again. Oh no! What the fuck? Why? I'm looking close- I'm looking very fucking closely, dog. Making sure the door is closed. Would you like to order something, sir? Oh no. Oh, and he's gone. And he's gone. Thank you for the one dollar tree, appreciate it. What the fuck is that noise? It's this old ass TV. I keep telling the boss to get a new one, but he's like, nah, CRT's classic, man. Look at the drive-thru menu. 
I don't think there is one. It's just checking the trash. I guess I should probably look out around there. He probably like left something. The day we first met, yes at Chilla's, she smiled at me like a flower. Just thinking about her makes my heart pound. I have never felt this way before. I wonder if she's putting a smile on everyone's faces like she does mine. Oh, that is so creepy, dude. I don't like that at all, man. And they have photos of me that they are putting screwdrivers through. Christ. Don't tell me you play as a woman. You do. Play Happy Game next? I don't know if there's going to be a next game, depending on how long this takes. <laughs> Who's at my door? I don't know if I want to answer that. But I have to progress the story, so... Creepy text. They found my house?! I know her best. Maybe after your mo mother and father, I'll really be number one in time. She talked to me. She picked up my phone and went out of her way to give it to me. I know she felt the same way I did. We are in love. Today is our anniversary. I'm never doing a good deed again. Ever. Well, I still gotta go to work. It's snowing. Guys, it's really Christmas. How did he even send that through my door? There's no mail slot. What if they're in your house? That would be kind of creepy, bro. That'd be like... That would be a federal offense moment. Go back in the house. Oh, you're right. I should definitely fucking check to see if they're in my bathroom or some shit. I don't think I can go back in, actually. After I, le after I leave. Jump scare incoming. Thanks for the warning, bud. But that's kind of a spoiler, ain't it? If I run faster than the jump scare, they won't be able to catch me. I'm going to swerve off in my car because it's snowing and this is not made for conditions like these. Question mark? The car won't start. I have to take the bus. Oh, fuck. They sabotaged my shit. Ooh, not a fan of this. Bus station's this way, apparently. You can't legally stalk you without your consent. I should tell him that. He'll be like, oh, shit. Really? Oh, my bad. That's a long-ass alleyway. Who puts a bus stop in, the, in, like, an ass crack of a hallway like this? Wait for bus. <sighs> Don't tell me that's the guy. Stalker, no stalking. Stalker, no stalking. Oh, you can hear your heartbeat. That's how you know something's about to happen. Hmm. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Fuck! Please tell me this is my stop. I hate it here, 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 I hate it here. Oh, it's very convenient that the bus stop is right next to me. Right next to where I work. Didn't like that at all. Am I late again? Probably. Where is my employer? Hello? Are you in the toilet? 
Oh, fuck. Ah! God. You scared the shit out of me. Leave me alone when I'm in the restroom. God damn it. Get to work. He wastes no time in getting out the building, does he? Why was I right about the toilet? Why did I... Hello, sir. Okay, uh... Two caramel macchiatos and two American scum caramel toffees. That guy is tall as shit! So two of these, right? Caramel macchiato. Two coffees plus steam milk. My car is outside? Wait, is it? Back door. You're so right. You're so goddamn right. Oh, thank God. So steamed milk plus vanilla caramel syrup, caramel sauce. Why did- is that just, like, supposed to be a time-lapse meme? Okay, what, what the fuck is Shaq in the back doing over here? Just tall as hell, giving me- giving me eyes from across the room. What- what's your deal, bud? I need to serve the customers? No, I need to throw hands with them. Come here! You don't look at- you don't get- you don't fucking give me eyes like that from across the room. And then not try to throw them. Oh. Hello, Professor Umbridge. I'd like a green tea latte and one of those waffles, too. Yes, the green tea la latte and waffle here are delicious. I always go for those two. Glad you like them. No, thank you for serving them. My son likes them, too. Are you alone? I'll give you this if you like. The rosary bracelet is said to ward off evil. You should keep it. I bought it from an infomercial on TV. They said some amazing things about it. Can you believe it? For only 9,900 yen! Oh, it's fine. I own a lot of them anyways. Oh, damn, she a rich bitch. In this day and age, it's so convenient to buy things through the cell phone. She's either, like, loaded or has so much credit card debt it's not even funny. Well, I, I mean, it wouldn't hurt to take the funny rosary bracelet. Right, order sticker. American waffle. That's the easiest one, I think. And I haven't made the green latte yet, I don't think. Green tea latte. Okay. Wait, vanilla syrup plus steamed milk. Plus steamed milk. Um, and matcha powder. Okay. Okay, can you guys believe it took me like fucking 20 years to figure out how to do this at the start? Who's baking? I don't know. I think these are all processed and are just kind of stuck in like an, like an eternal state of being good to eat, technically speaking. I can? You guys are really mean to me. I had kids by the time you figured it out. Improved a lot. Yeah, maybe I could be a real barista. Maybe I could really do this. <laughs> Hello, mannequin lady. 
She looks like the the James Charles spider. Sister, aren't you a cute one? Are you by any chance a model or something? I'm getting so many mixed signals. People, like, I've been called ugly as shit and model worthy. Thanks for the sub, Black Qualities. Appreciate it. No, nothing in particular. What a waste. I'm sorry, but you should definitely make use of the style you got. I mean... Oh, she's her name's literally Idle. You want to, me to introduce you to my office? Give me your number. Sorry, I'm not sure about that kind of thing. I see. I don't care if you regret it. I'll have a salted caramel mocha, please. Salted caramel mocha, right? Salted caramel... Okay, coffee plus steamed milk. Coffee? Coffee plus steamed milk. Uh, plus caramel syrup. Plus... Hazelnut syrup plus chocolate sauce. Here you go, lady. Did you change your name, though, Idol? I don't know. What a wacky individual. Absolutely peculiar. Peculiar, even. Bro, who cleans the milk steamers? Not me. I don't care if these people get food poisoning. She's so quirky. I did not think that guy was wearing pants for a second. He's not wearing shoes. Oh my fucking god, what the hell? Hey, hey, it's so hot today. I'll have a caramel chilla puccino. Excuse me, sir, could you please put on some clothes and not make a scene? Ah, eh, come on, I won't be here long. No, it would not, so legally that's out of the question. What, should I... Should I, shouldn't I, should I appeal to his legal senses or his, um, emotional senses? <laughs> they spent so much time rigging this dance, man, and look how much detail is in the pec muscles. Bro's got some man titties. Girl, you know a lot about laws and stuff, but I'm a guy, right? So if it's just the top, shouldn't it be fine? The police, huh? Then I think I'll go home, but I'll be back. Um... Christ. That's a clip cut. Clean toilet and take out trash. Awesome. Man, I am so strong. I can carry so many bags at once. What? This was in my house before. The I need to look to the right of my TV the next time I'm 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 home. Cause this was next to my TV before. Why was the door open? It is pretty much every time you have to take out the trash. I think? I don't know. Dirty toilet. Mmm, what a dirty toilet. Mmm, I want to lick it. What? Who said that? Is there toilet paper? Stay probably in the back, right? Am I sniffing the toilet? I'm doing a little more than sniffing it. What? Who said that? Take your order, sir. Latte. Awesome. Um. 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 It was steamed milk, right? Is 
The timer, the timer keeps going. The timer keeps going. Oh fuck, that's a countdown. Uh, there's another. Ooh. Latte. Okay, two lattes. I, I, we're coming right up, sir. Coming right up. Coming right up. No problem. This not a problem at all, dude. No issue. Fuck! Oh shit. Oh no, 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 I'm not gonna do this fast enough. Two lattes, two lattes. Awesome, awesome, dude, awesome. I'm panicking. I'm fucking panicking. I still gotta finish the order, you know? Like, I'm not just gonna fucking, like... I'm not gonna, like, not do it, dog. I already started. Might as well finish. Well. What? What happened? Um... 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 Guys, I'm locked in here. I'm... I cannot escape. Oh, shit. Uh... It was just a dream, guys. Holy shit. This is a sign you need to quit real. Okay, oh, thank God, it's still there. I thought somebody stole that shit. Wait, is there no bathroom? Oh, okay, there is. This is a fucking tiny-ass shower, dude. Snow. Awesome. I hear... Footprints behind me. I hear footprint footprints following mine. What the fuck? What the fuck? This is my car. Going to work, apparently. I think that's you stepping in the snow. I do not believe I was stepping, stepping in the snow most of those times. Is he even back here? I don't even report to my head manager anymore. Oh, it's the it's the PI. So my suspicions were true. I'm glad you contacted me. Calling the police won't help. All they'll do is brush things off to lessen their workload, which is why you with people like me. I'll take a look around and see if I can find anything. 
That's the homie. Shout out that. What happened with that door? Damn, she bad. But these two are bad as hell. Like, whew. salted caram caramel mocha here is so delicious. I think you'll love it, senpai. Okay, I guess I'll try that then. One salted caramel mocha. I'll have a dark mocha chocolate chip. Dark mocha chip chili pacino. Subi, you're not getting salted caramel mocha? Yeah, I want to try something different today. I already had one today. I see, but a chili pacino on a day like this. You are so young. Because it's delicious. How would you like to pay your bill? Oh, is today the day of the photo shoot or something? Is the store going to be featured in a newspaper? Uh, no, I don't think so. Why? What? But I saw someone outside taking pictures. Oh, no! Huh? Was he taking pictures of this store? Hmm, yeah, the store and you, most likely. Damn it, should have done my makeup. What are you talking about? I'm sorry, we'll pay together. The drinks are on me. What, are you sure? Thank you so much. I'm in a good mood lately. My son used to be a shut-in and is in a better mood now that he's going to school. Your son's in middle school, right? Yeah, I just hope he wasn't bullied at school. He was always a little shit at home, so I, I kind of figured he would be, so I hope it's not happening. I didn't have any good memories when I was his age. Okay, salted caramel mocha and chocolate, chill, chocolate chip chili pacino. I'll do the chili pacino first. Plus coffee, plus milk. Give the fucking photo to the t detective? Do I still have it? I don't. Where? What happened to it? I don't like that the music turns into this weird... Like, synth loop thing. Every now and then. From the calm music that it usually is. Chocolate sauce and cocoa powder. There you go. And yeah, salted caramel mocha. Coffee. Plus steamed milk. Coffee plus steamed milk. Plus caramel syrup plus hazelnut sauce. Car caramel syrup, hazelnut syrup. Chocolate sauce. Wait, 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 wait. Chocolate sauce. Caramel, hazelnut, chocolate. There we go. Ooh. Maybe I gave the PI the photo when I called him. That makes sense. Have I played Little Nightmares? Nah, it's on my list though. Damn, that piano riff is crazy. <laughs> Why, sis, you eat the photo quite? Who does that? I don't know. I was just in a paper chewing mood. Mmm, you want a coffee for your non existent kid? You have such a cute child, ma'am. Salted caramel mocha again. Man, these girls, these people love their salted caramel mochas. I think I remember the order too. It was caramel, hazelnut, chocolate. Damn, I didn't even have to look at the list this time. This game has good ambience. Yeah, and then it immediately throws it in your face.
She's the one that almost ran me over? Oh. Who's this guy? I like his flannel. Or their flannel. I can't tell from a distance. That's not even a flannel. I'm just blind. Why is she walking at like a 30 degree angle? Hmm. That's strange. Ma'am? Oh. I'm sorry. Give me the usual. Yeah, like I'll just know what that is. Sweet red beans and butter bread. Caramel macchiato. Well, I, I, know, I know how to make the salted caramel mocha by heart now, so... I'm gonna do that first. Caramel macchiato, coffee plus steamed milk. Steamed milk, uh, caramel syrup, caramel sauce. You know, I'm just, a after playing this game for an hour and a half, I'm just. I'm just now realizing that the interact sound is the looting noise off a dead body from Skyrim. Hey, are you repairing the store's antenna at this hour? Antenna? No, ma'am. Why? I saw someone on the roof. What? There shouldn't be anyone on the roof. It could be the investigator. Maybe I should check it out. It could have been my imagination. Anyway, the drink, please. I just gave it to you. The detective is probably dead. Yeah, I wouldn't put it past him. I need to serve the customers. What happened to checking it out? You're still doing orders? The whole game is doing orders, dude. Use the ladder and check the roof. One of one. Alright, boys. Cross your fingers. Let's hope I don't get stabbed. Oh, no. Oh, I need to get the ladder. Damn, I am strong as hell. I'm just, I'm using this thing like it's nothing. Climb? Yes. Rick. Oh, shit. Go down. New room, guys. New room. Oh! Oh! Someone's been living here! Oh! Close the store. Zero of 16. Fast! Shit, shit. It's not over yet. Oh, shit. Count products? How do I count the products? What do I use to count the products? 
One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. With the laser? Oh, oh, right, 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 right. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. Why the hell does this take so damn long? Where's the last thing? Where the fuck is the last thing? Oh, I, I forgot to trash one thing. Fuck. Flip the sign to closed. Okay. We are... Ah! Flip the sign to closed. I'm gonna juke this motherfucker. Oh, come on! I told you he would have stabbed him first. Okay, so you can't fight back. Got it. Alright, I have to... See, guys, the ladder is outside. Alright, let me... I think I know what to do this time. Or slightly better what to do. Why is this so damn slow? Oh, fuck. Oh my god. What what do you mean? Let me get in my fucking car. Oh shit. Oh fuck. I should take the car. I just tried. Why, why is my car not working? The roof, go to the roof. There is no ladder there, guys. My car is just busted. Keys are inside. Oh, fuck, you're right. Oh, shit, he took my stuff. No, are these photographs of me? Lost, I forgot where the door was. Ladder. The ladder is not here. There. Wait, no. Maybe I can use it in here? Where the hell is the skylight?
that's not an option. Got the ladder. Set the flat ladder on the floor in the private room. I don't see anywhere to interact. There it is. Guys, I'm venting. Brick. I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. Do I stay up there or do I beat the fuck out of him? dropped it on his head. Oh, there it is. Yo, I can see my feet. This game is more realistic than Call of Duty. Stay up and drop the brick. I'm looking for him. Looney Tunes his ass. There's a body? I see the body. We found that earlier. Dude just left or something? Yeah, he's like, I'm bored. I'm going home. I think you locked your ending. How, how does that work? Do I have to die and then try again? At the top right? Go here? Hey, we are got- dude, we are closed. You have to leave. You can't be here. Turn on wall hacks? Do you think the game's- I'm not sure. I think you broke the game. Do I have to die? You can't fall off the roof. I'm gonna walk outside and see what happens. I don't really have much choice but to walk around and such. Do it in here. Thanks for the subs in. Appreciate it. Are you on Ice Chewer? I'm, uh, playing a video- a horror game. I think I might have bricked it, though. No pun intended. Where are you, guy? I will beat the fuck out of you. I have a brick now. Yeah, I think I might just have to die. Like, I- I think I might have bugged it. I should take the card? Physically impossible. Already tried. Oh, my car keys were right there for some reason. Okay, I'm out of here. Oh, he's in the car with me? Probably. It's a good thing I brought this brick with me. Oops. Crashed. Oh, he's in the trunk. Did I die? I think I died. Flip the sign to closed. Okay, yeah. Drop the brick on him this time. Good shit. Stuff's gone. There's a ladder. Ladder. A 
fuck with a brick, you know what I'm saying? Got me a brick. Absolutely hammered. I killed a man. As I picked up that brick, that man looked right at me. If I didn't drop it, I, I thought he would somehow get inside and kill me. That man looked terrifying. I don't even know him. Why did he? I had no choice. I didn't mean to kill him. I was scared. I ran to the police. I told the police everything that happened. Then the police took me back to the scene, and that man was no longer there. There was no one there. The police took me back home and told me to leave the rest to us, and went to b investigate the scene. It's all over. I'm tired after all that happened. Now I went to rest peacefully at home. Yeah, I'm sure that'll work out, bud. I'm sure, that, I'm sure that'll work out. You dropped a brick the fuck you mean you didn't mean to kill him? Well, plenty of you guys in chat have admitted to throw- to dropping bricks on people in high elementary school. And you didn't kill them, so... What in the 2006 Sony TV? The cable is acting weird again. I should call the owner. He's gonna be in my closet. Where's my phone? Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, what the fuck? No one in there. Is it getting more distorted the more I listen to it, or is that just me? Oh, not this shit again. So true. It ends the way it started. Dune buggy car. I'm going back inside. Yeah, he's gonna be there when I get back, ain't he? Ringtone like a cartoon character tiptoeing, jeez. That's creative. Good one. My door was not closed when I came here. My lights were not off when I came here. Ah. Why would she not check the rest of her house? Oh. And that's the ending. They just dead. Just gets killed. Man bricked up for real. Yo, look at the supporter. Moron YouTube channel. I wonder if there's anything after the credits. You got all endings? Oh, neat. Could have dropped a few more bricks. <sighs> You're telling me it wasn't bleeding or nothing? Okay, sure, sure. Is this gonna be on YouTube? Uh, probably at some point. I don't know how soon, though. So what did we learn? People can survive bricks to head and phones are bad luck. 
through. Does anybody know if there's anything at this credits? Sorry, I have the Marvel brain rot. Where, where's the end credit scene? Where's the crossover with the Kool-Aid man? <laughs> Quite first stream, are you going to play another Friday Night Funkin' mod? Probably not tonight. I'm sure at some point in my life I will. Alright, I'm closing that. Also, did you know, if you guys watched this on YouTube, you missed out because you could have been watching live on twitch.tv slash quite on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, the days that I stream, you could have seen the horrors and the scares live as they happen, but you missed out, you know, like a punk. It, 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 that's kind of a you problem, man. That's kind of that's like a... It, I, I, don't, I don't know what to tell you. All right. Uh, I'm ending the YouTube recording there. I'm going to run a quick ad break, take a pee, and then we'll figure out what our next course of action is. Here's some relaxing Pokemon music. I'm starting to think that in the future it might be a good idea to, right before I jump into the outro for YouTube specifically, I specify the stream is not ending, um, and that I'm just doing this for the YouTube schmucks, and that because you're on Twitch you get extra content and more, you know, quality time with me, where you get to strengthen your parasocial bond with me, who you definitely know for real and am real friends with. <laughs> Dude, I've, I've recorded so many videos in advance this week. Like, on every single fucking stream, I've had, I've, uh, had a VOD that I could turn into a video. I got Monster Prom 2 that, um, I got Monster Prom 2, I got the Friday Night Funkin' mod. What, what did I play on Monday? What the fuck did I play on Monday? Wait, what? Holy shit, I'm so stupid. I'm throwing a blank, but I got, like, three videos out of VODs this week. So that's good. Four videos. Good, good timing. Good timing. By being on Twitch, you get bonus content after the YouTube recording. Yeah. In fact, most of, like a lot of the streams that I do. Thank you for the hundred bits, Death Plants. But most of the streams I do. Oh, the worst rated games on Steam. That's the other one. But um, most of the uh, streams I do are primarily content that only Twitch viewers see. Because usually recordings of YouTube take up to like an hour, hour and a half. Today was a particularly long one. The first stream you watched was the SAO abridged one. That was a good ass stream, man. I think I'm gonna I th I'm gonna look back very fondly on that one for a while. I bet. Twitch chat elite, so true, so true, so true, King. Pop off, pussy slay, vagina. You look so vagina slay today. The same developer that made that game has a couple more that seem pretty good. I'll definitely have to keep those in mind. Um, I might ask you for the links to those after stream, like for like Twitch Matt, like Twitch chat or some shit, like in a Twitch mod chat. I mean, fucking Christ, because I am looking for more kind of one-off horror games to play to make videos out of. Playing longer ones is kind of tough because you can't condense the narrative into one video and. A video, like a game has to do really well on my channel for me to make a fuck ton of videos on it. Like what, we're on video 7 of Minecraft Story Mode and that's supposed to go up tomorrow. <laughs> Jesus. 
You should play What Remains of Edith, Edith, Edith Finch. Minecraft Story Mode. When the video goes up tomorrow and episode 8 should be on Monday next week. That's the plan. I may or may not be going out of town in a week or two. Uh, the uploads will go as planned, but obviously if I'm away from my setup, I won't be having the guaranteed streams. Am I going to play Minecraft Story Mode Season 2? I think there's a good chance I'll play them on stream. I think the real question is if they'll get made into videos. Up till now, the whole series has been getting pretty consistent views and it seems like people are liking them, so... If numbers allow, if my wallet, if my need to pay rent allows, um, I'd like to finish the game, like get all the way through the series and have like a full kind of cut down Let's Play kind of style thing. That'll be like the first one I've ever done. But um, if not, I'm sure I'll have like, I'll at least like do them on stream. You're still up? It's not that late. I'm like seven. You saw someone say Dial Town? I've had that recommended a few times. It's like a dating sim made by the guy who did Day Shift at Freddy's, right? I, the, the only thing that like stops me is I need to think of a good dating sim clickbait title before I full commit. Time to go jump off a roof, see ya? Well, you know, use protection. Have a parachute on. Phone sex? Oh, that's a that's a good one, actually. Having just having phone sex as a title. Just having phone sex as a title. Can you imagine? I can see it now. Have I ever heard of the Backrooms horror thing? I actually did a video on it. I also have a song called The Backrooms. Hey, who here hasn't heard my music? Who here hasn't heard my awesome and great and awesome and awesome <laughs> music? I could, I could, I I could just plug all night long if my soul depended on it, man. I am totally capable of that. How would you have sex with Springtrap? That feels like not your business. That's kind of like a uh, between couples things. How did you forget the song? I don't know, man. I think you're just kind of a fake fan. Backrooms game, would you ever play it? I have. I have played it. It's in the Backrooms video that I have on the second channel. Me, sadly. You haven't heard Are the people saying me saying they have not heard it? I'm, I'm gonna just play it anyways. I, need, I, I haven't promoted it super hardcore in a while. I might as well just, like, fucking get my plug out, you know? I'm gonna play the back rooms, because that's the one that the most people have heard. Whatever, I'm gonna waste your time, and then we'll get into, like, an actual section of the stream. Look, Dick, there's a statue. Yeah, I was spread-eagling my ass cheeks in the mirror, just admiring how cavernous my butthole is, and I was like, that shit's endless. That's I think crazy, that's the best man. one, too, so let's... My ass is fat as hell. Holy shit. I'll let you see the lyrics. I have the fattest ass I've ever seen. Good grief. Hey, hey. Little boy with a mouth so big, you can swipe a credit card through his gap tooth. Paying for some snack food. Y'all stole your tweet, but had the decency to add you. Always running from something like I'm in the back rooms. All my friends on each other's asses like tattoos. We tear each other down like a bucket full of crabs do. Everyone I know, little dick, that's a statue. Always running from something like I'm in the back rooms. Rooms, it's red on my chest like a Zane goose. Everyone wanna fuck a mom like Chris Chan do. Most of what I do, I don't really think her plan through. I got trash taste like YouTubers in Japan do. Fine clothes and goodwill, I like them buying brand new. Made a couple friends of the folks that I lampoon. I don't moisturize skin looking like a sand dude. Cooling in my gamer chair, hunching like a sand true. True, beat the pussy red like Dexter. Staying hydrated, pissing lasers like the Death Star. A versatile guy, plenty in my repertoire. Crypto wallet crashing like a damn test car hey. Reading everything people say like the feds are I'm into weird shit, don't put F in my address bar Shitty 
at my job but still got it done like get smart it's because of nepotism like gave me a head start break the bed when we fuck it like we play a bed wars or be my dick like i'm known to beat a dead horse wipe the sticky shit off like a cleanser never open up under pressure like a chest door nicotine feed i'm smoking at the neck port primary care provider telling me to rest more balls touching when we fucking that's connect for bushy down there like the forest moon of endor bitch if you a cancer i'm gonna beat your ass like techno blade i ain't risking birth and what i'm getting of a Sectomy. Rip the, the homie Yoshi, she, she ain't dead, but she's dead, dead to me. Every guy I wanna fuck, fuck hates me like I'm just a mix. Only gun I carry has an orange tip like Sunny D. In middle school, I was pretty much everyone's underling. Played Minecraft and every other kid made fun of me. I'm pretty sure that traumatized me at least to some degree. Little boy with a mouth so big, you could swipe a credit card through his gap tooth, paying for some snack food. Y'all stole your tweet, but had the decency to add you. Always running from something like I'm in the back rooms. All my friends on each other's asses like tattoos. We tear Hell each other yeah, man, down like you. a bucket. Full available of everywhere. Everyone I know, little dick, it's a statue. Always running from something like I'm in the back rooms. So, to the person who asked why the back rooms, honestly, like it, I, the way I do it, in a way a lot of uh, rappers do. I, I don't want to call myself a rapper officially, but it's like, well, the the way like they'll do it is like they'll be writing the lyrics and they'll think of the name later. I had just I had written that back rooms bar, uh, pretty much, and. I ended up using saying it multiple times because I thought it was a good hook. And I was like, you know, it, it's it's referenced in the song. It's just that. And it's an easy visualizer to make. Um, this is on Spotify. Yeah. Oh, th thank you guys, by the way, because the backrooms, Pest has already cleared 200k streams, but the backrooms is about to hit 200k as well. And uh, Cracker, as in, the, as in the food, as in the snack food, as in the snack food. Um, is on its way to 100k, which is crazy. I really appreciate this part of the music, guys. I know it's like YouTuber shit, so I understand why you'd be skeptical. But you know, just even if you like gave it a chance and didn't like it, I still appreciate you giving it a listen. Working on new stuff. Just farted. Just farted again. World War One. Nice. Why the snack food name again? There's like. The opening bar is about the snack food, and I just think it sounds funny. Like, if, if you've noticed, my songs are really all over the place. I, I kind of, like, I'm literally just talking, it's very stream of consciousness, just making jokes, cracking shit. They're more meant to just be, they're not about any specific subject, it's just kind of jerking it to a peep. <laughs> That's the worst way imaginable to put it, but yeah. All of your songs are in my favorite song playlist. Hell yeah. Appreciate it, man. No theme to the songs you mean? Pretty much, yeah. <clears throat> what should we do, though? Any videos we were meaning to look at? Jerking it to a beat, call my dick Mozart. Quite songs or musical tweets. There are a good amount of tweets that I like were originally meant to be song lyrics or tweets that I turned into song lyrics. Cause it like writing them is like kind of the same deal. You know what I mean? <laughs> Pooed in my bed, so true. So true, King. So true. Remember when the cookie song came out? You were advertising my song so damn much I got kicked from a group chat because of how many times I plugged it. It's bookmark too, cheese. You ever think about writing a song just based off your past tweets? I, I don't know if I'd want to do a song entirely off my tweets, but my past tweets have definitely popped up in songs. Have I ever played volleyball? I've played it. I've never been good at it. That's a given, though. Like, do you, do I look like I'm athletic? Do I look like I'm capable of athletic feats? <laughs> Are you gonna call that dude that asked for your number spring trap will get mad? I don't think so. Quite just join what's up. Uh, we finished the YouTube recording part of the stream, so now we're just kind of hanging out. 
Trying to find a video to watch. I think uh, we could do Jacob Geller. Oh shit, you know what we could watch is that internet historian video I've been not putting off, but just kept getting sidetracked about. This is, it, he, uh, like a week or two ago, he dropped a video about Area 51 and I still haven't seen it. I've been meaning to watch it for like ages. I love internet historian, great guy, um, great videos. You got, I'm sure all of you are familiar with him. He makes great stuff. Let's, uh, let's give it a peep. And also let me fucking fin fix my VTuber. Aliens, they exist. And what's more, they're here and they've been walking among um, us for millions. He said among us. Years. Just look up at the night sky. Each one of those lights is probably an alien. Shoot at them, and the police show up. Coincidence? Break into the CIA. Just looking for clues. They put his, you on dude, his earth. editing is so sick. Like, there's like a thousand references per minute. The pace at which he, like, just pelts you with shit is incredible. My list. Coincidence? There are no coincidences. Shoot random bullets into the sky and you get arrested. Coincidence. Locked up tight in area 51. And so our story begins with one man. Joseph Experience. On Joseph June Experience. The of the solar year, Last name Experience. Middle name Rogan. Joe spoke to a whistleblower. Right! Bob Lazard. Now, Bob claims to have worked at the Area 51. And so, Joe summoned him to his sensory deprivation satellite, where he could ask him probing questions about the that government facility. machine that was able to read the, the size of your dicks. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dude, there is fucking nothing like Joe Rogan out of context clips. Like, he has... I feel like more of that dude's life in the last 20 years has been recorded on audio than hasn't. And there is absolutely no way there is not just hilarious shit of him in every context. It's so good. View for yourself this Also, you can tell why these videos take months to put out. Double testimony. I wonder if he still does it all himself or he's got people working with him these days. You used to work at Area 51. When did things get weird? Breaking Bad shirt. Well, the way this went down was, I only got hands oh, on it's a nerd with breaking one of them, bad shirt. and I was fucking an alien. It produced a little discharge from the bottom. <laughs> it was exciting. You know, we turned the lights on, and all these guys are there. So what in the fuck is this? We have, you know, actual hardware from another civilization. It's a big. Um, Also, with the contact with clips of Joe Rogan doing anything, you can make any conversation flow between, like himself. Like, you, have you seen the Joe Rogan meets Joe Rogan video where it looks like a completely fluid conversation? You can make any false interaction look believable with all the shit there is of this man. Live in a house? That's bullshit. I like just swinging around on trees. Absolutely. We are the sex organs of the machine world. But for people who don't know, let's give them the bullet points. How right. tall are you? I'm 5'10". You don't seem to have any muscle. You know, it's <laughs> like a frame. Is there anything else you'd like to say? Uh, if well, this entire video is just Joe Rogan at us, that would that be, I, I would on. be here for the whole 40 I minutes. I saw it still. sitting there, and I thought, oh my god. Hey, Bob, it's probably a good idea if you shut up. I worked underground with the aliens. They shot my hand off. They're underground. There's bases. They're shooting lasers through the Earth's crust. And they move them at light speed. You, you big fucking... What? I'm not even doing anything. Drop down. <laughs> hey, why don't you come on out to the Nevada desert? This edit is really good, but it is going on for longer than I thought it would. Deal. Get the fuck out. All right. That's it, folks. He, oh, he got Good the night. fuck out. These revelations were sent out all over the globe using beams. Absolutely free. And it started an incredible awakening. Also, this came out on April 1st, so I don't know if that has any importance to how the video is going to be formulated. Just farted. Disseminating the people's brains with knowledge. There's a lot of a higher for April 4th. Exploring so. them with the revelation of it all. An orangutan with a spear. And soon they were bursting with righteous curiosity. Bigfoot is a human animal hybrid. All right, here's the Google searches for Area 51. That big spike there, that's when Joe Rogan put out his podcast. You get the idea. And just see. 
it reached the right man at just the right time. A 21-year-old named Matthew Roberts. Facebook user wears he a hat. He heard about aliens in Area 51 before. And he believed. He wanted to see them. Real bad. But what could he do? How could Start he a Facebook possibly group. get into Area 51 to check him out? Think, 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 think. Use that big old knock on your ears. One. If I ran into Area 51, I would be shot and killed. Wasn't a Tozy at this? If me and all of my friends were in this, we'd both be killed. But scenario three, if there were so many of us, thousands, so much fodder that we eventually ran <laughs> out of squid game, bullets, dude, just getting shot. someone surely is going to get through and touch the gun. He's used that 6-9 running with the gun area. thing so much. My God. Within minutes, he was drafting a Facebook post. They can't stop all of us. I'm willing to die for the government. Let's do Dude, this. I mean, I got a, I got a decent video out of this one as well. I remember this whole thing. On September 20th, 2019, we'll all meet up at the Area 51 Alien Central Tourist Attraction and coordinate our entry. If we Naruto run, we can move faster than their bullets. Let's see them aliens. This event then goes into the ether. And from here, it was up to the Facebook algorithm gods to decide what would happen next. There's a lot Your here mama. to be excited about. I think this could be very positive. I love how positive. nobody showed up in the end. I, I thought a good people did. A good amount of people did, but none of them were stupid enough to like actually try to storm the base. They just kind of treated it as what it should have been, a big meme. For our society and economy. People from all across the flat world were receiving the invite, and they began pressing the attending button. Attending. RSVP. They showed up and partied. And see, like, I thought about going to it because that sounds like as a one-off event, like it could be a really fun. But I don't know. I was too damn lazy. Within just a couple of days, the event had picked up hundreds of thousands of attendees. People loved the idea so much, they began making memes about how they were going to raid the base. So many I can barely show you a fraction of them, rapid firing them out like the bullets that would soon be gone. Auto generated, them down. AI generated memes, real. <laughs> and so the event spread and spread around the internet. Eventually, this is the last time Facebook was relevant in the public consciousness for something fun. Morphing into everyone who is something is going to raid Area 51. Didn't this release to a video from going all over the globe are joining up to fight for the future. Nigel, a runner. No pointer. Runner. Stevens, agent. Silent, a runner. Freeman, 713. I am a sentinel. Everyone's <laughs> doing their part. Are you? We have the ships. We have the weapons. Kept time to put his gun down! How can we use fucking Alec Baldwin? Oh my god. Oh my god. We need you all. And just like that, the game was on. Are those pool noodles? That was like a different thing though. Like they had like a, sp a meetup of a hundred Spider-Men or some shit. Next time. Here's the new campaign. You're gonna love it. I'm sorry, but I gotta skip the NordVPN. The I think we've had you Welcome to the mission Map 51. Developed in 19 background. Who is Area 51? Welcome to the mission brief. Let's do a bit of background. Oh, the Josh fight. 51. Right, it was Secret like the military number one job. First developed in 1955, this is what it looks like on Google Maps. It's approximately this big. Total area size, big as hell. 51. And the volume, a big mystery. How deep does it go? Until 1997, the government refused to even acknowledge that it existed. That is, until they were forced to by lawsuit. That lawsuit was about the death of two men who were former employees. And how did they die? Well, not aliens, but rather toxic fumes from burning garbage. Yep. Yeah. Oh. So what they would do is burn a whole bunch of cool, high-tech refuse. It, it is kind of 
fun, like we they're hiding something there i'm sure like it is a fucking official military base for the united states but it's pro like if they're not hiding aliens it's probably just like some fucking pollution shit that's killing a bunch of a bunch of people and i don't, don't want to get deep into the conspiracy stuff but i don't know it could just be like something very sinister but not nearly as exciting use on the lot let the deadly smoke blow downwind and the staff was stuck breathing it in a few years later bing bing bong cancer awesome very Other fun than that, the public hasn't really been told anything so all people can do is speculate as to what the hell is going on in there I there's think absolutely keeping... something down there maybe not aliens but there is something down there or all the hypes for nothing i hope it's aliens that'd be so fun it'd be so dope of a ufo there we don't know if it's aliens we don't know if it's time travel we don't know if there's many i wonder like the reason that the u.s government has like not been super coy about this alien stuff i bet they're thinking like oh shit they still think it's aliens good for us man they're completely off the trail on that one is in there uh, virtual reality that seems i'm kidding obviously so incredible i have no idea at least sexy but what has <laughs> Bro just wants the alien puss like the rest Leeches of us. Is that they do test flights on new alien craft. Oh, what the fuck are you me? <laughs> Produce Women? new <laughs> alien tech. Breed the latest version of the newest gayest frog. Do not get it confused with Roswell. That's over here. Area 51's over here. And the final thing that we know. Wait, is Area 51 is not in Las Vegas? Where is Area 51? Okay, it is in Nevada. Where is Roswell? Roswell's in New Mexico. Okay. Security is top notch. They have that thing locked down. Too bad there wasn't a Channel 5 in on it. There were still all gas, no brakes back then, and they weren't really do. Actually, no, I don't even think they were around in their form they are today back then. That would have been very interesting to see. So, you want to break in anyway. Okay, but it's going to require some research. And the first thing to find out, has anyone ever tried breaking in before? I'm sure. Yes, several times. In fact, in January 2019, an unnamed man broke through security barriers and drove eight miles into the base. He got out of his car with a metal cylinder in his hands and the military opened fire. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what he thought was gonna happen. Scene. And there was this time when a film crew from the BBC was arrested for trying to get in. This is BBC News. This time when a vacationing family of four went off track. You get the idea. They're not messing around. Put your fucking hands up. I'm not going to tell you again. But there's one story to top them all. And oh, we'll disguise his identity. I remember uh, there was like some two folks who tried to bust in but like got arrested he really is fast. My personal hero. The month is November. The location, Las Vegas. And the protagonist, a professional limo driver. Now, he's more than a little unhinged. Ryan he Gosling. decides to start Actually, harassing Ryan and Gosling sending death threats to a lawyer, whom we think was going to represent his defense for this incident. If you've ever seen oh. this TikTok, <laughs> Bro, that's our boy doing donuts and driving backwards down the Las Vegas Strip. Anyway, fast forward three weeks. It's like six in the morning, and this guy is already doing donuts at a car park near the airport. Then he decides to drive from the car park into the airport itself. Offense? No problem. He drives right through it and onto the runway. He's just driving around, whizzing between planes, almost crashing several times before eventually parking on a ramp. At this point, he jumps out, puts on a clown mask, and storms right. Wait, are, this was in like this had to be in 2016 if he was doing a clown trip to a private jet. He announces, aggressively, to the flight staff that there is a bomb in his limo. Oh! Quote, I have a fucking bomb. I'm going to blow this place up. His plan? To commandeer this private jet. Yeah, that'll and work. take it to Area 51. <laughs> However, oh. as sound as this plan was, Absolute the quick genius. response by police meant that it wasn't really working out. So, he bails back to his limo, tries to make an escape, until eventually police catch up with him. Yeah, and no surprise point, there. He is quickly arrested. They take Baby him in driver. for questioning, and he starts telling them, That's right, I did it to see the alien. He just wants to he see aliens, he doesn't have any motivation to be on that. The chosen one. 
And by the way, I have high security clearance. Also, I'm involved with the mob. And someone <laughs> owes me millions of dollars. Later on, the bomb defusal crew checks out the limo and determines that it's just a fire extinguisher with a bunch of wires and duct tape and some fairy lights. <laughs> now, at some point, <laughs> it's a he fucking gets prop bomb, dude. Holy shit. Out, presumably on bail, and CNN reporters walk up to him and start asking him questions. No, no statements from me, he says, but you should talk to my lawyer. And then he proceeds to hand them the business card of the lawyer that he's been sending death threats to for oh the last, my God. last three weeks. Amazing. After all that, the judge Jesus, dude, that was just one big fuck you to the lawyer he hated, huh? Sent to a mental hospital for assessment. Yeah, not, not really surprised there. Or so they say. Convenient. <laughs> Eddie Hearn moment. Okay, so people have really died trying to do this. That means we're going to have to be a little more covert. So over at Area 51 HQ, the military can see that Facebook numbers have reached 1 million. And it doesn't take a genius to calculate that even if just 1% of them show up, that's... Wait a minute. Run those numbers. 1% is 10,000, right? This many people. <laughs> In a crowd that big, this bound to be a calculator. Hey. will do something stupid. In fact, the military took it so serial that they even went over the nuances of Naruto running. This is a real oh my, slide. Oh my god. Oh my god. They they put out the full name too. They didn't just say Naruto. They said they used the Uzumaki last name too. The act of running like Japanese anime character Naruto Uzumaki in which a person runs very fast with their torso forward and arms back. I believe Sonic the Hedgehog was doing this Wait. first. And it required a real demonstration, of course. <laughs> now, some undercover operative then took a photo of that brief. Oh and they <laughs> my god! It. They intend to use our tactics against us. Alright. So if the military decides to do this... <laughs> things could go pretty bad... Uh, AC-130 simulations have come so far. ...for Matthew. So Matthew goes back to his mind palace. Think. 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 He's like, hey guys, uh, this was, this this was a, a joke. Instead, let's do a music festival. This would give Matthew an alibi and throw authorities off the scent. I'm willing to music festival for the government. Let's do this. All right, Reddit. Here it is. Alien Stock 2019. <laughs> the official EDM party. Hosted by Matthew Roberts. Set to take place in Rachel, Nevada. A town that just so happens to neighbor Area 51. Mm, it has clever. 50 total clever. residents and practically no infrastructure. Perfect. Yeah, nice try, fellas, said the military. And the captains and the generals all started planning their own EDM party. <laughs> with the new state. party. Three groups in particular. Introducing Group E. The E Local State Police. Police have their work cut out for them. The mask, the amount of masking this party, video must have taken is ridiculous. They could be upwards of 50,000 people descending upon the little town of Rachel. Lincoln County commissioners trying to tackle the tough task of preparing for a potential inundation of people. And Sheriff Every Car single person in the town is in this building right now. Lee has less than 30 deputies. The county declares a state of emergency, and they allocate an extra $250,000 worth of enforcement for the weekend of the raid, as well as an extra 300 police officers and paramedics. That many people are going to stress the community to the point that it, it just, it, we can't cope with it. This is How do they the even, like, eat, get food? Like, it, who delivers it's it? exciting stuff that I've ever gotten to work on, and I'm- Hold on, Mark. Group D. The defense. And I'm going to take up my gun the and defense. shoot somebody. So the FBI agents that showed up, they showed up at 10 a.m. They contacted my mom, and she was like, so she texted me, she's like, the FBI's here, answer your phone. So I was, I was kind of scared at this point, but... This report from the Nevada just chilling Department these of Public days, Safety was released last year, and it features some very interesting details. For example, they caught a group of YouTubers trying to plant a tracker on the bus that goes to and from the base. We're gonna pull an epic prank. Highly <laughs> illegal. And you may not be that surprised to hear that the military isn't actually that worried about people breaking into the base. Turns out they have automated weapons. Yeah, no, I don't not think how anybody thought that was gonna weapons. go better. Automated. 
whatever that is. No, instead, they think there's potential that real terrorists will, you know, do the thing or a thing. So, counterterrorism was given a budget to sweep a chemical by the, the fact that there's an official military document that goes this in depth with like precautions over like this actually happening shows how big the shit got back then. Radiological and explosive material. Although, nothing was found. And there's just one. I wonder more... how many people died from raiding it. Directly from the raid that Matthew Roberts set up, I don't think there was any casualties. If like from what I remember, it was a fairly laid back event, all things considered, like nothing disastrous happened, but people have died trying to get into Area 51 Plus before. Getting involved as well. The mm, corporate press. Disinformation agents in the mainstream media were getting involved. Soy milk. They immediately started warning people not Verified to Verified check. Use hey, of me. lethal force authorized. Spouting contempt for the stormers. What started as a joke Facebook event quickly turned into a phenomenon reaching well, it began as a Adjusting joke. Adjusting the program is much more seriously. serious. Astroturfing campaigns by late night haha -ha men, number one. <laughs> late night haha -ha -ha men. They'll see them tasers. Ha ha ha, laugh it all up. It's just a big joke. People who say they're interested just keeps growing. Faster than their bullets, let's see them aliens. And they weren't afraid to give some of the biggest, brainest takes you've biggest ever brainest. heard. It's not clear the 1.1 million Facebook followers who said they are going to storm Area 51 are real and not Russian bots. <laughs> yeah, <stop. laughs> Damn genius! Yeah, that, that's, what, that's what Putin was most concerned about at the time, I'm sure. Fine. We'll make you take us seriously. Let the training begin. What is this font from? Is this the, is this the Vsauce Minefield font? Or is it something else? And speaking of that, I think it's time for my workout. And so the Raiders began training. We train for Area 51. So let's go. Sandwich. They Sandwich. Began pushing their body. God. He's even the same as Doc. Pushing their will. Pushing their spirits. It's all Naruto themed, man. Pushing their mind. Pushing their friends and family's patience. <laughs> Uh, Who wants to call me to kick some alien butt in September? No way, all weaves. Yeah, it's surprising that so many of them showed up, considering that the outdoors is all new for them. We out. New for me too. I'm being a hypocrite there. Let's be honest. I do not go outside. And that's what like you guys know. I God defend my hero academia to the death. So like, I'm I'm just a big old hypocrite. That's how it goes. This will be like in the metaverse. Why was that door so well masked to his hand? As we zero in on the day of the raid. The count is up to 2 million attendees, and that puts us on par with the world's largest standing army. So to coordinate all of these troops, we'll need a battle strategy. Lay it on us. From r slash memes, intel was being filtered down to the troops. I'm, oh, dude, I remember these the diagrams. <laughs> oh, Tommy in it. Intel. I remember these infographics, though, like just people saying the Chads and the Kyles will go to specific bits like that. Was being filled. It's kind of a fond memory back then. Like, that was the last year we had before COVID, so. Down to the troops. Groups such I wanna, as. I want to see what he uses the Tommy footage for as a bit. The Minecraft YouTubers. The Norms. <laughs> the Weeds. Facebook Moms. So he child, just uses Chads, the stream. The crack kids. Is it the 5 o'clock free crack giveaway? Florida man. The Australians. The gay Reddit mods. Okay, this thread is locked. Gay Reddit mods. They all had their role to play. So, Godzilla comes in from the east while the Australians make a distraction that allows the minion cosplayers to breach from the south. I mean, this is this is actually described in Sun Tzu's Art of War. You surround the enemy and choke them off from supplies. If there's enough of us, we could technically outlast them until their rations run out. These very serious strategies would have to be disguised as memes so that they could be spread across the <laughs> Wait, wait, what was the, the original? Would have to be disguised as <laughs> Main force. Players to breach from the south. See a Dodge course, Viper SRT8. Strategies would have to be disguised as memes so that they could be spread across YouTube, Reddit, and TikTok without the threat of being. Although, not everyone was as tech savvy. Authorities managed to nab one of the main cartographers. 
and they pressured him into an interview on the television. Um, it took me a total of five minutes to put this image together. It was sort of <laughs> like a, a battle strategy almost. Kyle's with monster energy buff. It was completely rooted in satire. That was just completely rooted in satire. And no one should raid. This is just completely <laughs> They're whispering a it into his air. Just a joke. Mission counting sheeple complete. You can take him out. No. <laughs> Okay, so remember how we're not raiding anymore and it's just a music festival? Wink, 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 wink. Well, bad news. Okay, so it sounds like you maybe are looking at changing venues. Possibly. Possibly. <laughs> it's all up in the air. We're putting Maddie on the spot here. There's a lot of challenges, so. <laughs> but it's two weeks away, so. Yeah. <laughs> He's kind of got to, like, uh, figure it out, I guess, somewhat soon, right? Yeah, it's all kind of falling apart. Oh, yeah, a little bit. Just a tiny See, bit soon. Matthew had organized alien stock with a few other people. But his main business partner was Connie West. I didn't plan it. It planned me. But Matthew is the headliner. His name is attached to everything. And he's starting to get worried about a fire festival type situation in the desert. Be a fire fest 2.0. He wanted to make sure there's plenty of water, food, security, Stop. insurance, go. et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And here... I mean, it seems like, like as memeable as it is, it seemed like the main guy behind it was trying to make it a genuinely cool experience to have that wouldn't get people in the ER. Deals and communication start to break down. Eventually, there's a lawsuit and it's kind of boring. Things that they were supposed yeah, to- Yeah, it's kind of boring. Pay for I'm stuck paying for Who cares? We're gonna skip it. But the TLDR <laughs> is that they had a disagreement and Connie said, I don't have to prove to you what I spent. You didn't sign a fucking contract with me to begin with. So guess what? I don't need to prove to you a motherfucking thing. And Matthew said, Matthew then took $70,000 worth of sponsorship money and declared Alien Stock and Rachel cancelled. <laughs> Bro took the dough and ran! But then, at the same time, Bud Light walks in. What? We're saved. They say, hey, why not do it here? In the Vegas. It has plenty of lighting, indoor plumbing, it has everything. Bro, Bud Light just swooped in out of Matthew nowhere. Said yes. And then using the website for Alien Stock, he told everyone to not go to Rachel and instead to go to Vegas. Welcome to Alien Stock Las Vegas, sponsored by Bud, Bud Light. Light. Bud Light, huh? Also Pornhub, but it's a long story. Also Pornhub. Pornhub is left to pick up the pieces. However, she would not be discouraged so easily. She decided to press on. It's going to be a great party. No matter what, it's going to be a great party. She had to take full control of the event and Rachel, dipping into her savings and even... Fuck, so there was like competing events? Mortgaging her home. I'm working out of my own pocket. I think this is a liability. I'm out. So is it clear what's going on? It's worth doing a very fast recap because... Oh, that the government was splitting up our forces, boys. There's an event in Rachel that's been declared cancelled, but also not cancelled. Also, I forgot to mention there's an event in Hiko that isn't cancelled, but it will be on the second day. There's also that third festival in Las Vegas, which has the former promoter of the first one, and they both share the same damn name. And none of this has anything to do with the actual raid on Area 51, which is here, which has several gated entrances, by the way, and none of them have been declared the official gathering point. Confused? Yeah, pretty much everyone was. It's a goddamn mess. People, rightfully, put the whole thing in the two hard basket and instead of going to one in the middle of nowhere, just went to the one in Vegas. <laughs> Let's fast forward to the weekend of the raid. For better or worse, Rachel is about to open its doors to the millennials. Hell yeah! Alien Encore now has come to an abrupt halt. Don't let the aliens get you, kid. Exactly. Do you believe in aliens? I don't. I don't. Run! Get out of here! Oh, you know, I want to hear about the alien liberal agenda. They could have some good talking points. We don't know. To protect my mind from interference. We have a wanderer. Don't let me leave, Mer! It could be anything stuck. But it's alien stuff. How do you see walking with that shirt up over your head like that? I don't. And the first ones are supposed to be always, you know, the best ones. Paranormal lawyer. PhD level field investor. Stuff in downtown Las Vegas. Did they change the name or is it still alien stock? I think I'm on my highest high I've ever been in my life. Yeah, she looks like she's having a great time right now. And, and we are taking a look kind of the area here. You've done a, a lot of work in a very short period oh of time. Oh my God. The security's here, the medical's here, the food is here, the people are here. And most importantly, toilets are here. 
Toilets. The toilet's the most important part. She's so right. Yeah, that was pretty good. I, uh, I, just, I just went through a breakup, guys. Well, it wasn't quite the event that they had hoped for. But they did do a commendable job of acting retarded for the news. <laughs> this is the most fun I've ever had in my life. Do you think of yourself as a hero? I, I do. Here for scientific reasons. This is like the most millennial thing that's ever happened. Yeah, that's for the Naruto running competition. But don't let's forget. Were, right? Hiko. Or the Heiko. No one knows how to pronounce it. This event was being hosted by George Harris of the Alien Research Center. The owner of the center is Las Vegas businessman George Harris, creator of Alien Tequila. If you want to have fun. Alien Tequila? If you want to have a great look. How, how strong is that branding, really? With a vendor village of 10 food trucks, a gift shop, and three time Grammy Award winner Paul Oakenfold. What? For some reason. Really? I was told there's a lot of people coming. Uh, well, right now, things are kind of slow at the Heiko event here, so that's kind of a disappointment. Now, Heiko Base Camp was expecting somewhere between 1,000 and 20,000 attendees. Yeah, that didn't really happen. Quite huh? a range. Maybe 50 people here. Clapping some alien Bruh. cheeks. Yeah, but no cheeks are clapped. Where's at the all? cheeks? None. Zero Where's the cheeks? cheeks? This is like the first of a big thing. Uh, sure, but. It wasn't board said in fact it seems as though the majority of the attendees were actually the press one huh. lady believed that her parents is actually alien so after the first <laughs> night they decided to cut their losses and cancel the whole event you know the producers of the show it's very 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 expensive and it just didn't make sense because basically all of the attendees were stolen by alien stocks 2019. i don't think anybody's surprised by that they went to the one in vegas we were going to go the to uh, is. Rachel, and then we decided that we didn't want to get stuck in the desert. Uh, as much as I like Mad Max, I don't want to live it. The Las Vegas Alien Stock, sponsored by Bud Light, was a smash hit. They've got carnival rides, photo Yeah, ops, this one like really went, apparently. And even a pool. No huh? running. Who could have predicted this? You make a post at 2 a.m. with on a page that has 62 likes, and now you have thousands of people that are ready to come out to your show. It's just, it's absolutely amazing. Damn. I guess I'm glad at least one of them went well. In Anor Londo, operations were ramping up. They're adding more guards, upping the security, and enforcing a no-fly zone across the county. They were even oh. infiltrating raider groups. You could be standing next to an officer and not even know it. There was a like really undercover presence here. And they were giving stern warnings from the PR team. They posted this tweet. The last thing millennials will see if they attempt to raid area. Holy shit! Day. Sorry to disappoint you, Yugi. <gasps> You triggered my trap card! Millennials immediately seized upon the tweet, doing what they do best by pretending to be offended, successfully having the tweet taken down, Bruh. forcing a public apology. I'm retarded. All right, this video is getting very long. Let's hurry up to the main event. That's why I, I like a long the in a historian video. Hey, are you coming? Yeah. Always. The following's an accurate recreation of events. Not dramatized in the slightest. Damn, these, these visuals, like as shitposty as they are, are insane. <laughs> going, going full in with the anime aesthetic. <laughs> actual footage, actual footage. Oh, this is great, dude. Bruh. I almost spit out my goddamn water. Wow, 
Why is the perspective kind of accurate with the 2D, like, disc they're using and shit? Priming minds. Yeah, this is the, uh, this is how the finale of Code Geass went. Mates. Do they really get people to VA for these? I think they probably just took like voice lines from existing shows and just lied about the translation. You know, a lot of people like the, the like the subbing shit to make it say whatever has been a common thing. Yo, it's the Lambo! <laughs> What? Wait, what did that subtitle say? You can't, the consequences will be too terrible to imagine. Rethink what you are dying. Big blue laser in the sky. Area 51 lives. Tragedy. Victory, but at what cost? It's not over yet. So AIDS. <laughs> the, the Wii Sports music, that's great. This is exactly like Half-Life 2. An elevator, I'd recognize one anywhere. That was nice of them to conveniently mark which uh, alien room is it. Very, very efficient organization. Thank you for saving us. And it has fat tits. We are so grateful and horny. And yes. We wish to be your big titty goth alien GFs. <laughs> and you won't be a virgin Reddit browser anymore. <laughs> I wouldn't quite like that, but it was pretty close to something like that. That Although was I so could say over the top, a small group showed up to the main gates themselves. Where are the million people? Of over two million people? In total, only about 200 actually went. It's not about the quantity, it's the quality that counts. Nice outfit. Thank you. <laughs> People mostly oh. behave themselves. I mean, I think it's awesome you guys are you guys are following the laws, following directions, so but they weren't about to leave without a consolation prize. Yo, it's a toesy! <laughs> Some of the Area 51 soil. Top secret rock. Top secret rock. Rock, rock, rock. <laughs> You can have it. It's from Area 51. Thank you. Okay. Also present at the raid were a few YouTubers. So I came here to get myself an alien as a pet. We're here to 
Oh, Rocka Rocka was there. It's like Halloween, but we're just annoying people. <laughs> but we're just annoying people. No. You, you watch anime? Yeah, so you got the rebellious youth, and then you got people trying to lure E.T. into a cage with Reese's Pieces and stuff. That's a pretty good summary of the crowd that you have out here this weekend. But Red respect Rockman, to the true heroes. Security for keeping everyone. Ah, just kidding. It's the guys who got underneath this fence. God Make sure the sub clap alien cheeks. Very, very, very and this cameraman appropriate for the times. raided the base. Yeah, I got it. I see. And this random woman who decides to just start walking. Police, right there. No one's stopping her. Oh my huh. god. She's gonna make it. She's going home. Why did they let her get that far? She gets charged for trespassing and receives a $1,000 fine. Oh, okay. Ah, uh, but soon it was time the to wrap up. The storm is over. Because everyone's moms were there to pick them up. And if they were late again, there would be big trouble. Okay, good night, everyone. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to sleep now. Hmm? Good night. I'm going to bed. The end. Psych, it's not over. There's one more thing that I want to tell you about today. Because Storming Area 51 would go on to inspire a plethora of other events. The storming of Loch Ness. At what? Pink what is that? From all of us. We think we have seen it. What did it look like? It looks like a big stone. Over yeah, 27,000 said they were going. Actual number six. <laughs> okay, but storm the those dudes might be like why not? those dudes might be like lifelong Jungle friends now though. And potentially millions actually went, but the you know the evidence would be lost. So how would you know? I am under the water. <laughs> I am drowning. Or how about storm the Vatican? They can't molest us all. Oh, interesting oh twist God. on that one though. Someone cancelled the event. But overall, everyone had a pretty good time. Isn't that what Area 51 was really built for? Having a good time with the boys. Just something like that, you know what I mean? I haven't quite... Christ, that was great. That was great. Ugh. I'm glad I watched that on stream too, because like... I don't know, his videos are great, uh, like just to view, but like as a shared experience, it's a, it's a real banger, I'd say. <clears throat> W video? Yeah, hard to agree. Alright, stream's not over yet, guys, but I do have to pee, so... Yeah, in the meantime, I'm gonna milk you guys for some money, and then after that, we'll probably play some... I don't know, chill Doom, chill something. Just, like, hang out, just chatting, play a game, I don't know. Nothing too high stress. I'll be back in a minute, though.
Hi guys, Wendy's nuts hit your face. God, I wish they would. What? Who said that? So weird, who said that? Can we just pick something random to type in chat for when Quiet gets back? Bit late for that, but bit late for that. Have I heard of Kukuro? I've heard of it. Never seen it. <clears throat> My new song and... <laughs> I, was about, I, I was reading the Nightbot message I've written like a month ago as if it was a normal message. I'm losing my mind. I'm actually going insane. It's kind of crazy. <sighs> Your cat says hi. Um, hi to them too, I suppose. Hope they're doing good. Just hacking it, chilling, that kind of thing. We live in a society? Well, yeah. Duh. Dummy. Dummy. You want a banana? Suddenly trying to squeeze in another promo? Well, chat was technically the one who brought it up. I was just reading the thing they initiated. That's all. This is my first stream. I was making a Twitch to stream and I looked up quite to follow him and now I'm here. Welcome, man. Hope you enjoyed your time. What's the name of my new song? Um, a word that I can't say on Twitch for fear of my life. I'm literally just sitting here. Calling me dummy live on stream, bro. I could have called you way worse. Thanks. My cat is currently acting like I have never fed her and I'm the worst person alive because I'm too broke to afford her fancy cat food. I mean, as long as you're feeding her, they're definitely being overdramatic. But that's just how cats are. Smoke has tried to dupe me into feeding her twice plenty of times. Yeah, can I tell you something really, really fucking mischievous Smoke did the other day? So she, I, I had her, she's walking around the apartment. Um, and she was sniffing at the closet that I keep her food in. And the bag of food that I keep her shit in is, um, can't keep her shit, poor choice of words, but the bag of food is pretty close to the door. So what she did was she reached under the door because her paws are tiny enough and cut a hole in the bottom of the bag so food would spill out and she could eat it as it slid out from under it. I... <laughs> So A, I need to cut her nails, and B, I had to push the thing further back in the closet. It was ridiculous. She acts like I never feed her, but I don't... Mm. Smart kitty? Unfortunately. She's a genius? Yeah. And the th it makes me feel a little bit better about myself, though, because despite how smart she is, she still likes me, so I must be, like, doing something all right, you know? Gotta be doing an okay job. Your cat is a dub ass. Dub ass. <laughs> Why does your mother not love you? I don't know. It's like a you problem. You cut her nails or does the vet? I'm too scared to. Usually I take her to the vet to do it, but I feel like I probably should have learned how to do it myself. Because she only goes to the vet so often. So it's like, if I want to manage that shit, I probably should just do it myself. Especially with how long they are. Like, I can't even carry her on my shirt without... Like, she can't knead on my shirt without it, like, poking through the skin deep. And I would very much like to hold my cat, you know? Take her to the vet to cut nails, really? It's not It's not that, like, I take her to the vet to get her nails cut. It's like, when I'm at the vet, they do it for free. So it's like, why not? 
and I it, like I said, I don't go to the vet like very often, so that's the real cat experience, though. True. If you get her used to holding and touching her paws, it's a little easier to cut them. Yeah, I'd be I'd be holding that shit a bunch, but it's not too hard as long as you don't hit her quick, lol, and she's not squirmy. She's pretty good about being held, but if I were to like try to hold her in place where she doesn't want to be there, she'd probably be a, a little bit of a, bit, a bitch about it, a little bit of a rant, a skeevy little mischievous little rant. What's my opinion on reboot vans? I have not played Fortnite in so long, dude. Man, it's easy. Just don't... Listen, dude, I don't want you to tell me how easy to do the thing I've never done before. Especially after you've probably done it for ages. Thanks for the uh, sub, Alexander the Great. Plus, a lot, a big thing for me is, if I make the vet do it, she doesn't associate the, like, the annoyance of getting her nails cut with me, and I don't have to deal with the repercussions. <laughs> What's her age? Um, she's coming up on like, she'll turn two this year. I don't know her exact birthday, but um, the main thing is that I got her a few months after they found her or so like, I got her on election day. So that's like what I consider her birthday. Gaslighting her cat, I'm a, I'm a professional. Knowing how to trim cat nails means you have a job that'll be forced on you by friends and family for eternity every time you visit them. Everybody I know either gets other people to trim their cat's nails or already, or like who has a cat, already trims it themselves or gets someone else to do it. I'm never cutting a dog's nails. Like, that's just too much work. And also, like, the claws aren't as big of an issue. With cats, it's like the paws are so, like, are so in intrinsic to how they, how they, like, show tactile affection you gotta you gotta take care of them you know i usually try to give my treat my cat a treat after every paw to make her still love me i guess she if you associate it with something positive like yeah you get a nice treat if you let me do this shit what's your opinion on sonic exe i actually have a full video just kind of doing a retrospective on on sonic exe if you want to peep that I have another one planned on like an old nostalgic horror character as well, but um, I, I don't want to spoil that one, but peep my Sonic.exe video if, you, if you're really interested. <clears throat> if you don't cut dog's nails, it deforms their feet eventually. Well, I don't know a dog, so I'll get to the specifics if I ever own one. I'll obviously like do proper dog care, but currently I'm not a, a pet owner of a dog. <laughs> like actual Sonic EXE? Yeah, that is my- that is a video on Sonic EXE as a- as like a whole, as a phenomenon. It- it- it-, it it's the whole thing. So if you really want to know my opinions on the whole thing, that video. I'm not talking about the mod, I have a full video on the actual thing. What do wild dogs do then? I think part of it's probably the fact that the fact that that's a thing that happens is because they were selectively breeded and those genes just kind of came through. Wild dogs, I couldn't tell you. Maybe they have like a, a natural way to shave them down or they just don't have the problem. Or maybe they just let the shit dig into their, their nails and get fucked. I don't know. Is it true dogs' paws smell like Cheetos? I, how, how am I supposed to answer this with any degree of certainty? <laughs> Did I ever beat Can't Run or Triple Trouble? You know, now that you at, since you mentioned the Sonic.exe mod, I do have a video of me clearing that entire thing as well. Um, if you wanna, if you wanna look at that video as well. You can also peep that video too. <laughs> Oh, you're giving me so many opportunities to plug my shit, man. Appreciate it. That's very kind of you. I guess wild dogs aren't supposed to be a thing. I don't know the full etymology of them or like the full, like how, where they trace their roots to. Like, I don't know if wild dogs were an offshoot of domesticated dogs or if wild dogs already existed. Flinders did such a good job editing that video. He usually does. 
Guy's great at his shit. He's great at what he, he's great at editing. Subscribe to Quite plus Quote plus Quite plus Quite with a Y. I got too many damn channels. It's already bad enough that two of them are like doing well. <laughs> Can you imagine if the third one, like, imagine if I started uploading to Quite with a Y consistently, and then it popped off. Like, life would be living hell for you guys. It would just be impossible to be a Quite viewer because you, you don't know which channel to send fucks to. Quite? Yeah, Quite with a Y. It's basically my throwaway channel. I do like gameplay commentary shit there, but like only when I want to, which is really, really all over the place. My retirement channel will be called Quit. That's funny. That's funny. If your friends were to be in triple trouble, who would be Tails, Knuckles, Eggman, and EXE the song? Um, hmm. I think Tails would be Nuka. Um... I want to say Hyojin would be Eggman. Uh, Grawlix would probably be Sonic. And Knuckles would be Elliot. Uh, Knuckles would definitely be Elliot. That's, that's, those are, that's my final take. How come the only time you see my message is when I say one word and it's a stupid fucking question? That's just how the cookie crumbles sometimes. Thank you quite. I shall note this down. Wait, what? What do you... Is this relevant to something? You know what? I'm not going to pry too far. If, if something comes of that, that'll be cool, but I don't want it spoiled for me. Imagine Hyojin and Eggman cosplay. Her head is already an egg, so it's not that far off. Sorry, that was really mean. That was file. I said worse to her. Who cares? <laughs> Holy shit! Ooh. Damn, damn, damn. I saw Sonic 2 and a guy walk in with a whole Eggman cosplay. Hell yeah. That guy sounds cool as hell. All right, I'm going to play some Doom. Um, to anybody who's new to the stream or doesn't really stick around for these parts, when I play a game at this bit of the stream, it's literally just chatting, but there's a game in the background, so there's not really a reason to leave. It's literally just me talking, responding to chat while I do something else. Um, I don't know. Much, it, it, not much changes. There's not really a switch in topic or anything. Can you send a YouTube link that I can play on stream? Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Impossible quiz? I think I'd, like, rather have a good time. I think I'd rather just enjoy my time streaming than doing that, you know? Yo, thank you for the five gift subs, Art School Trash. Holy shit. Appreciate it, man. That's really nice of, nice of you. And considering you're in art school, that means that, like, that must have been your entire savings account. So that really means a lot to me. You were willing to give that up for me. I got into Doom because of you. I love to see a Doom con a Doom conversionist or a Doom convert. Your PC is being laggy as hell. That is unfortunate. All right, uh, I'm gonna do a mode that will I will definitely die a fuck ton on. But um, I'm trying to beat. What is it? I'm trying to beat uh, Ancient Gods Part One. Um, on like a fresh nightmare game, a fresh nightmare playthrough. So I'm gonna delete one of these and then do it again. Should you play the DLC, you beat the game? Yeah, I'd recommend it. I really like the DLC. That's what I'm playing now. You got into drawing, so your next piece will be my me, my boyfriend's spring trap. Thank you. Never played Doom? Oh, you're about to watch me play. All right, I need to fuck with all my rune settings. Because, okay, I want... Nope. I need my movement control, my glory kill distance, um, and I need my... Where is it? 
No, I don't I don't really use the bullet time shit. From Glory Kit. Yeah, this one's fucking goaded. Okay, uh I need that to have that. I don't really Sorry, I'm just making sure everything has the right weapon mods on it. Okay. Is White Claw your favorite drink? It's like my go-to when I'm just chilling at home. Um, I definitely drink other stuff sometimes, but you know, it's it's my it's my at home, not doing anything super important kind of drink. You know what I mean? Okay, I have this on the wrong mod. There we go. Blue access. Yeah, this calm Pokemon music is really fitting for the video game that I'm playing, don't you think? Mixing J Fuel and White Claw? I've never done it, man. That is just not really in my wheelhouse. Let me make sure this is on a. Uh... Okay, it is on. It does. It is on the right difficulty. There we go. This is the most random stream you've you've ever seen. I don't know, I like to think I'm a variety streamer, so I do like just kind of, you know, I do the thing for the video, but I also do like just kind of what I feel like playing at any given moment. A lot of times that is just sitting and talking with chat with my VTuber on, you know? Sometimes you misspell quite as quote, but it still works because I have a channel name quote. Yeah, it, you know, I never realized that I and O are next to each other on the keyboard, and they're, like, both form the words that, that I misspelled to make my names. Thank you. Uh, yo! Oh, it's, I thought it was fucking, like, actual gifts, like, actual sub from Ludwig, but thank you for the gift subs, man. I appreciate it. Why the fuck is it slow motion? I did not have that rune on. I need to I need to fuck with that real fast. Hey, I should have gotten the health from that. But you know, whatever. Whatever. I should have gotten the health from that, but whatever. That quit I I did not mean to have that bullet time stuff on. I don't know why it, it included that. Why why did it go half time? What the fuck happened there? Because as far as I'm aware, this is the, um, this is the rune that makes it so that you slow down time. What happened there? I'm so confused. Unless this was that rune? Doesn't seem right, because I've had it equipped for some time. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna change that rune, because it, it fucked me up more than it helped me. A speed boost. I'm gonna do the glory kill one. If you are near death, time slows. Why is that never activated when I've had it put on before? Fuck, I hate this arena. This is the first stream I've caught, and did you know that most old stories of large octopi are actually whale penises? Not super surprised. See your Russian monkey, have a good one.
What did I get the idea for the name quite? Just misspelled quite, didn't I? Based in red pill. What flavor of White Claw do I recommend? I'm partial to mango. I think blackberry's pretty good. Um, passion fruit sucks dick. I will say that, like, with no with no pomp or circumstance. That shit sucks. What difficulty am I on? Nightmare. What the oh, fucking Christ? I feel like I sh I feel like I dodged those, but uh, my reflexes might just be off tonight. Streams are always fun to catch, but you always stream when these other guys I'm liking are streaming. I mean, listen, man, you're more than free to go to them, but I don't, I don't know if you've been around Twitch much. It's not like, whatever. There we go. It's like 2 a.m. where I am. Just live in the United States. It's so easy. To live in a better country. So simple. Okay, this is like the first arena where I die a fuck ton of times at. never seen this game but it looks cool yeah it's one of my favorites personally i got play this shit so much i've reached i like i was on like sabbatical with it but i've come back to it uh very in a very big way recently Comfort Doom, gonna go pretend that you're not forever lonely because of gay. God fucking damn it. I hate getting like stuck on enemies. Try to get me to Doom for OC Quest, but it didn't work. 
Uh, yeah, dude, Doom VR is so fucking tough. Like, I, I did not really like playing Doom in VR. It's not really a game that I think is super optimized for that kind of gameplay experience at the moment. The high octane shit, the amount of, like, weapon switching you have to do. And I played it on PSVR, to be fair, which is, like, suboptimal VR to begin with. game looks like something your dad would play. I mean, Doom's a really old series, so I wouldn't be surprised if, like, a decent contingent of people who happen to be parents these days are into it. How the fuck did I miss that? Holy shit. Christ. Your dad played some of the old Doom? Yeah, it's like a classic PC shooter. I personally consider this one to be a classic PC shooter too, but you know what I mean. That was like THE PC shooter back in the day. Okay, cool. There's like a life around here that I need to get, because I could really do with those things, considering how much I die. Okay, so this way. Drop down here. Secret bit right here. There we go. What the fuck? Nice. <clears throat> Take a swig of water. What color lightsaber do I like? Um, in Star Wars The Force Unleashed, there is this black kyber crystal you can get on the Death Star, which is the final mission. And I always thought it was cool, because it was like... If you've seen the Darksaber, it was basically the Darksaber before the Darksaber existed. And it um, was in the shape of a normal lightsaber. And I've just been obsessed with that coloration and the black being the center of the saber and the white being the outline light as like it's like a kind of a reverse deal ever since. I've never gotten over that. You played Diablo? It's fun. I've heard good things about it. I can't believe you actually responded to my spring trap drawing comment. I mean, I try to respond to whatever message I actually, like, see in chat, and that just happened to be the one this time. That's actually fucking cool. Lightsabers are sick. Hard agree. There we go. Oop, that could have gone really badly. Where's a, where's a fodder demon when you need one? That's not a fodder demon! Crucible versus lightsaber. The Crucible is obviously more useful because of, like, its application within games, but I just personally am more attached to lightsabers as of how I grew up in the series that I consumed and shit. Puggers. That's probably one of the cleaner runs I've had of this part of the, uh, of the level. Oh, Marauder moment. I 
I need a grenade for the setup that I like to do. There it is. Oh, what the fuck? Screwed that up, Jesus. Well, I guess the wolf just went back there or some shit. Not good, not good. Anyone here like snakes as much as I do? I have a whole book on my favorite type. Fair. Okay, there we go. That was a little more difficult than I was hoping, but I'll take what I can get. I have been forgetting to blink. That happens a lot when I play Doom. I just get so locked in because I'm such a gamer. Who would win in a fight, Octane or Bane? I don't really know. I don't play a whole lot of Apex. Um, and it also depends on the version of Bane, because that dude gets juiced to ridiculous amounts depending on the continuity. What was there was like a different one I was using. Getting a speed boost. For some reason I like the way faster glory kills feel. Like just as far as game I don't know, the, the speed one probably has more actual practical use. Am I one breath load? Speed? Yeah. Easy. So vagina slate today, King. Okay, bit overkill there, but I'll, uh, you know what? Better overkill than underkill. Faster glory kills is usually the one you use. Yeah, it's, it, it like, for game feel, it, it, it's better, but I feel like actual practical, what'll get me out of a tight spot, the speed boost is probably gonna make me move a bit in, a, in like, better ways, maneuverability-wise. Opinions on fortune cookies? They're fun, but... I don't know, there's not really much opinions to have. It's a piece of fucking paper. Okay, time to be locked into the cutscene. I wish I could be at home playing Halo. Yeah, I, I heard that Halo is actually finally getting a season two. Um, at the end of, uh... Or on the first of May, which is like... You know... Should have happened a very long time ago, but better late than never, I suppose. Not good, not good. Holy shit, that almost did not go my way. Uh, if you would come here, sir, I would really like to just harvest your carcass for some ammo. Because apparently that's how you make flesh in this game. Or how you make uh, ammo out of this game is with flesh. And then there's an arch file here, I think. Okay, not good. There goes my extra life. Christ. Uh, I don't have the energy to try and get past that hurdle right now, so I'm gonna wrap this stream up here. Been going for like close to four hours, Jesus. I appreciate you guys coming out, sticking around this long. It's been a fun stream. I'm going to run a quick ad break while I look for someone to raid. Thank you for hanging out. I will see you guys on Monday. Hmm.
Is there anyone playing Doom right now? See you in your nightmares? Sure, bud. I'm sure I will. When I go to sleep and I twitch and have anxiety and sweat, it's because I'm imagining that I'm talking to my Twitch chat. Um, I'm thinking I'm going to... Um, I think I'll probably throw this one Jimmy's way. I don't think I've rated him in a very long time. He's playing some Elden Ring. Anyways, thank you guys for coming out to the stream. It's been fun. I expect to see every single one of you in here. Blah, 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 blah. I'll see you on um, Mon Monday. Yeah, Monday, Monday. At least Monday if I don't decide to stream sporadically over the weekend for whatever reason. All right, have a good rest of your night, y'all. Thank you for coming out. Don't mind me. Oh, my God, he's blocking it. <laughs>